<laughs> Go Buster! It looks like Buster is going for a stroll through town. Hey there, Amber the Ambulance. Ouch! Buster drove straight into the lamppost and bumped his mirror. Aw, Buster's got a boo-boo. Luckily, Amber the Ambulance is right here to help. Poor Buster, there's no need to cry. There, now Buster's as good as new. Uh-oh, a pin in the road. Look out, Tony. Ouch. Oh, no. He's got a flat tire. But Amber is on her way. She can help. Amber always knows what to do. A band-aid, pumping up his tire again, and Tony's back to his old self. <laughs> Here comes Scout. She's going too fast. Ouch! She's bumped her nose on the wall. It seems like everyone is getting hurt today. She'll know how to help. There. Rubbing it better should stop it hurting. Scout looks very grateful for Amber's help. Amber is such a great friend. Buster's back to normal and driving around again. Tony's tire is working just fine. Scout is having fun playing with her bouncy ball. It's great fun to play outside with your friends. Oops! Buster got bounced hard with the ball. Amber's coming to help. I think Buster is okay after all. <laughs> Look! It's Buster the bus! And there Scout the little car. They look like they're having such good fun. Buster and Scout are best friends. I think they're going to play together. Looks like Buster and Scout have gone to play at the beach. Look at all the fun the two friends are having. Scout's zooming ahead. She's very speedy, and she loves to drive around really fast. Hey there, Scout! Buster and Scout love to tease each other, like all best friends do. Wow! Nice stunt jump, Scout! Scout has an ice cream! Oh no! Buster knocked it onto the floor by accident. But wait, it's Iggy the ice cream truck. There we go, two ice creams for Buster and Scout. Look Scout, there's no need to be upset. Buster got you an ice cream. Hmm, tasty. I think Buster and Scout are having a race. Oh look. They're all covered in sand now. That was fun, but now they'll need to get clean again. Look, it's Ashley the fire truck. I wonder if they can clean off Buster and Scout with the water hose. That's right, Buster and Scout are squeaky clean again. Thanks, Ashley. Bye-bye, Buster. Bye-bye, Scout. What a nice day we've had! Hello, Terry! Oh my goodness, it's a very windy day! And look, here's Scout and Buster. But what's wrong, Terry? <laughs> oh no! The wind has blown away all of Terry's fruit and vegetables! That's no good! Scout, Buster, can you help Terry find his fruit and vegetables? Of course you can! Terry has a red box. Scout has an orange box. <laughs> and Buster has a green box. Let's go find all the missing fruit and veg. 
Buster has a green box, which means he needs to find something that's green. There's green grass, some straw. <gasps> wow! It's broccoli. Broccoli is green. Well done, Buster. Put the broccoli in the green box. Scout has got an orange box, which means she needs to find some food that is orange. Oh my goodness, it has been a windy day. That's a green tree. No orange fruit or vegetables here. Keep looking, Scout. What's that? Oh, well done, Scout. Carrots. Carrots are orange, so they go in the orange box. Finally, Terry. Terry has a red box. I think Terry has spotted something already. In the dirt, Terry. What can you see? <gasps> Some tomatoes. Well done, Terry. Move that dirt and there they are. Good work. The tomatoes are red, so they go in the red box. Well done. That's everything. Terry is very happy. All of his fruit and vegetables are back in their boxes. Well done, Buster. Thanks for helping, Scout. Broccoli, carrots, and tomatoes. See you next time, Scout. Bye, Buster. See oh, no. Bandit Bus is stealing from the candy shop. Stop, thief. It's Otis the police car. He's come to investigate the case of the stolen candy. Bandit Bus went that way, Otis. I don't think Otis saw Bandit Bus get away. Great idea, Otis. Follow the trail of candy. I think we know who it will lead to. There he is. Stop, thief. Look, Otis. Some more clues. Keep following the trail. Wow, Bandit Bus is dropping a lot of candy. Oh, hey, Buster. Oh, I don't think that candy is for you. Buster loves candy. Oh, dear. The trail of candy has led straight to Buster the bus. Otis must think that Buster is the thief. You've made a mistake, Otis. Buster is innocent. Poor Buster. What are you going to do? Otis is putting Buster in jail. Oh, Buster. Oh, here comes Scout. Maybe Scout can help Buster get out of jail. Oh. You have to help Buster, Scout. Prove he's innocent. Oh? <gasps> That's right, Scout. Follow the trail of candy to find the truth. Oh. Scout the detective is on the case. <gasps> there he is. Bandit Bus caught red-handed stealing from the toy shop. You're going down this time, Bandit Bus. Stop right there, in the name of the law. You're under arrest. It's time to put things right and get Buster out of jail. Come on out, Buster. You're innocent. And in goes Bandit the Bus. Thanks, Scout. You're a great detective. If it wasn't for you, Buster would still be locked up. I'm sorry, Bandit Bus, but you had it coming. Stealing is against the law. Well done, Otis. Bye, Bandit. It's sports day at Buster School. How exciting. First is the 100-meter sprint. On your marks, get set, go! <laughs> go, Buster! He's the winner! Hooray! That was easy. Buster is the fastest in school. Next up, it's the high jump. Scout's up first. Scoot, scoot! Wow, that was awesome! Buster thinks he can beat that jump. Off he goes. Oops! Don't worry, Buster. He doesn't look very happy. It's the egg and spoon race next. Ooh. 
Get ready, and go! Buster really wants to win. Whoops! Buster was going too fast and smashed the egg. Oh, dear. And Ash is the winner. Well done, Ash. Buster is annoyed about losing. He really wanted to win. He's so upset that he isn't playing ball with the others. That does look fun, Buster. It's not just about winning, Buster. It's about having fun! Hooray! Now they're all having fun together. It's time to present the medals. Buster is third, Ash is second, and Scout is first. Well done, everyone. What a brilliant day. It's Buster the bus. I wonder what he's up to today. An Easter egg hunt. There's one Easter egg. Nice work, Buster. There's another. That's two. And three, four, five, so many! Whoa, that's a lot of Easter eggs, Buster. Mmm, they look yummy. Buster loves chocolate eggs. Tasty! Buster's eating as many eggs as he wants. Good morning, Buster. Oh dear, Buster looks very unwell. He has a tummy ache. I think he ate too many chocolate Easter eggs. Here comes Scout the car to see if Buster's okay. He looks really sick. Poor Buster. Scout is going to take him to Amber the ambulance. She'll be able to help. There's Amber. She always knows how to make little buses feel better. Hmm. Hmm. Yup, Buster is sick all right. But luckily, Amber has some medicine to help. Open wide, Buster. That'll make you feel better. But that's not all. If Buster wants to fix his tummy ache, he needs to eat some healthy food, like an apple. Hmm. There, that'll soothe Buster's grumbly tummy. Oh. <laughs> the next day, Buster is feeling much better. Oh, hey, it's Diggly the Digger. What's Diggly got there? Uh-oh, I think Buster has had enough chocolate Easter eggs for one Easter. Buster is having so much fun playing on his drum kit. Oops, there goes a drumstick. It's rolling over to Mommy. Hmm, what's Mommy doing? Oh, she's clearing out all Buster's old toys. The ones he doesn't use anymore. I wonder what's inside. Look, Buster's baby drum. He remembers that. Mommy is going to recycle it so someone else can enjoy it. Buster is sad. But he has a bigger, better drum kit now. But Buster wants to keep his little drum. He doesn't like to let go. Here's Scout with her tambourine. She's come round to play. Hooray! Time to make some music. Buster and Scout are ready to play. And here's Ash, too. He's come to listen. Now Buster and Scout have an audience. They're ready to rock. One, two, three, four. Nice. Buster and Scout are really grooving. Nice work, guys. Scout shakes the tambourine. Buster bangs the drum. Oh, he's trying to play his little drum at the same time. That doesn't work so well. He's trying to do too much at once. Oops. Aw, Ash wants to join in. But he doesn't have an instrument. And Buster has one too many. What's he going to do? Buster is giving his little drum to Ash to play. Now Ash can play along, and all three of them can have fun. Ready? One, two, three, four! There! That sounds even better than before! At the end of the day, Ash is going to give the drum back. But Buster...
Buster knows he doesn't need two drums. He wants Ash to keep it. Ash is so happy! What a kind thing Buster did. It's a did. sunny day at Buster's house. And Buster and Grandpa are having a great time playing together. Mommy Bus is off to work. Will Buster and Grandpa be able to make dinner together? Whoa, some real cooking! Buster is very excited. Let's cook! Grandpa sets up the stove. Hmm, but what comes next? Buster has an idea. It's chocolate sauce. Hmm, Grandpa doesn't think that's quite right for dinner. Let's take a look at the recipe. They've gathered all the ingredients together. Buster starts by adding some flour to the bowl. Whoa, easy there, Buster. Oops, the flour has gone everywhere. Now Grandpa and Buster are covered in flour. Buster is adding the finishing touches to the mixture. Careful the mixture doesn't go everywhere. Great job, Buster. Oops, Grandpa's tomato sauce has splattered all over the floor. And what's going on at the stove? The pot is bubbling over. Oh, look, it steamed up his glasses and now he can't see where he's going. Watch out, Grandpa. Oh dear, this isn't going very well. Grandpa and Buster are clearing up the mess. But Mommy Bus is coming home from work. Uh-oh, they still haven't made dinner. What are they going to do? Grandpa gets some fish fingers out of the freezer. Aha, this gives Buster an idea. Time for chocolate sauce. Mommy Bus is wondering what Buster and Grandpa have made for dinner, just as they're finishing up. I wonder what they've cooked. It's fish fingers and green beans. And chocolate sauce. Are you sure about this, Buster? He gives it a try. Hmm, delicious. Mommy also gives it a try. And it's surprisingly tasty. Well done, Buster. <laughs> there, all squeaky clean. Nice work, champ. We've got to look our best for Great Uncle Busby's lunch. He hates mess. Trust me. Oh? Hmm. Let's get going, or we'll be late. And Buster? Uh, yeah? Stay away from those muddy puddles. Hmm. Ooh. Huh? Hmm. <laughs> huh? Oh. Huh? Uh, guess we need to use the car wash again. <laughs> I'm clean. Let's go. Oh. <laughs> hey. uh -huh. I'm so excited to see Great Uncle Busby. He always has such tasty lunches. Chips and sandwiches and cheese sticks. Mmm. That's right, Buster. And carrot cake and steam buns and lemonade. Do you think you'll have blueberry muffins again? Do you, Daddy? Do you? I hope so. And peanut butter and ice cream and... Oh. Huh? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry! Hmm. Car wash again? <laughs> Hurry up! We're gonna be late! <laughs> Come on, Daddy! I'll race you! Oh, yeah? Here I come! <laughs> Kate! <gasps> Whoa! Oh, steaming gaskets! Starting any moment. 
Whew. We made it just in time. Well done, Buster. Thanks, Daddy. Okay. Let's go see Uncle Busby. <laughs> Sorry! Oh. Huh? <laughs> Daddy, hmm? I think you need to use the car wash. <laughs> Look, it's Buster and Scout. But what have they seen? Oh no, Terry is stuck in the mud. Buster's trying to push him out, but it's no good. Terry is really stuck. Now Scout is trying. Oops. Now Scout is stuck too. What are they going to do? I think Buster has an idea. I wonder where he's going. He's zooming down the road. There's Tony the truck. He's going very slowly, but he pulls over to let Buster go past. Now Buster is driving as fast as he can down the road. Vroom, vroom. Now he stopped. I wonder what Buster is up to. Oh, wow! It's Super Buster! Hooray! He'll be able to help Terry and Scout. Now Super Buster is flying as fast as he can. Here he is to rescue Scout and Terry. Oh, look! He's using his laser powers to lift Terry out of the mud. Great job, Super Buster! Now he's doing the same thing for Scout. Just like that, they're safe again. Hooray! They're so grateful to Super Buster for saving them. But that's all in a day's work for a superhero bus. Whoosh! Off Super Buster goes. Ah, Buster, it was all just a dream. But what a fun dream it was. It's time for the annual nature race, which Daddy Bus has organized. This is going to be so much fun! Ash and Buster are going to work together. They need to race through the woods as fast as they can. And the first one back gets the shiny trophy. Get set, go, go, go! Bandit has overtaken Buster and Ash. He really wants to win. What is he up to? <gasps> He's changed the sign! So Buster and Ash are going the wrong way! Oh no! <laughs> huh? There's no more path! This can't be right! And what's that? A huge tire print! Ash thinks it must be a monster! <laughs> nope, don't worry, Ash. Monsters aren't real. Uh-oh, I think they're lost, but they need to keep going. They're slowing down. Oh, dear, they're stuck in the mud. What are they going to do? <gasps> what is that? It sounds like a monster! Ah! Ah! <laughs> Don't worry! It's just a monster truck! And they're very friendly! She's pulling Ash out of the mud! Wow, she's strong! And now it's Buster's turn! This monster truck is called Mira! She's lost too! Just like them. Buster says they can work as a team. There's Naughty Bandit. He's almost at the finish line. But look, Buster and his friends are ahead. They ended up taking a shortcut. <laughs> Hooray! Mira won the race, but she couldn't have done it without her new friends. And she's won the trophy! Yippee! But Mira feels sad for Bandit being on his own. 
She knows what that feels like. Bandit feels bad for cheating in the big race. <laughs> Don't worry, Bandit. There's no need to cheat when you have friends by your side. And it's always fun to make new friends. Buster, your tooth is about to fall out. You will have to get a robot tooth to replace it. What? This is all my fault! Don't be silly, Diggly. Everyone knows when your tooth falls out, you lose it forever. Forever? Forever? Look, a tooth! Maybe we can get help there. We'll never get there in time. We have to get there. Scout, sirens on! <gasps> We're doomed! What are we gonna... What are we gonna do, Buster? Okay, so here's the plan. Scout, you... Scout? Scout! Vroom, vroom, vroom! Bet you can't catch me, uh, Mr. Rubble! Uh, stop this flim flammery at once! We have a tooth to say. Are we nearly there yet? Yeah, I'm running low on charge. Yes, I think so. Just one more road. Uh, Buster? We can do this. Buster. But, but, it's gone. It's gone forever. Yes, it is. But a bigger one will grow in its place. A, a, a bigger one? I don't have to get a robot tooth? <laughs> Deary me, no. And you can keep your old tooth. Wow, it's amazing. That's even cooler than a robot tooth. I want to lose my tooth now. Can I have a go, Buster? There's Buster and Scout. <laughs> They're having great fun playing in all the muddy puddles. But, oh no! Poor Scout is feeling a bit sick. Aw, it's okay. They can play together again tomorrow. Now Buster is heading inside <laughs> and grabbing a snack. But, oh dear, he's not washed his muddy wheels before eating that apple. That's not very clean. And he's left muddy wheel prints everywhere. The next morning, Mommy comes to wake up Buster. But, oh no! Buster doesn't look well at all. Poor Buster. Whoa, he's got a temperature. He'll have to stay home today to get better. Now it's time for some medicine. Buster doesn't like the look of it, but Mommy knows it'll help him get better. There, that wasn't so bad. Now Buster just has to get some rest. The next morning, Buster is feeling much better. <laughs> Scout's feeling better, too. They can go outside and play again. But wait. Mommy says they should wash their hands first so they won't get ill again. Ah. 
Good job, everyone. Wait. Mommy has another idea. They can wear these face masks, too, so they don't get sick. There! Now Buster and Scout are ready to play outside safely. They're so happy now that they're feeling better again. Look at those paint brushes. Buster and his friends are painting the walls in Buster's room today. How exciting! Mommy Bus is bringing them lots of different colored paints. They can paint the wall underneath the window. Hmm, what color should Buster choose? Scout has chosen purple. And Ash has picked red. And Buster? Yellow, of course! Let's paint! Oops! Ash adds a red splat to match Scout's. And Buster adds a yellow splat. Awesome! I wonder what Scout is painting first. It's a rocket! Awesome! Cool! Buster's go next. What's he going to paint? <gasps> a bumblebee! Not on the cabinet, Ash! <gasps> now they're having a paint fight. Be careful! That paint is very messy! Oh dear! They're getting paint everywhere! What a mess! Uh-oh, the yellow paint is all over the floor! <gasps> and now the purple! Yikes! Mommy Bus is wondering what all that noise is. That was so much fun! Uh-oh, they didn't realize they were making such a mess! But Buster has a plan. They can use Ash's hose to clear it up. The water is washing away the paint. Great job, Ash! Oh no! Mommy Bus is coming and they haven't finished clearing up the mess yet! Time to get all cleaned up! Ash is hosing Buster down. Splash! Now it's Scout's turn. And that looks like so much fun! And finally, Ash. Well done, everyone! Wow, the room looks completely clean! Time for Ash and Scout to head off home. Oops! Well, not completely clean. Buster and his friends are on a holiday at the beach. What a fun day out! Wow, the sea looks amazing! What is that in the water? Ah! It's a shark! Buster is very scared! Oops! Watch out, Iggy! Mommy Bus is taking a nap on the beach. Buster is trying to tell her what he saw. It had scary fins and jumped out of the water. It was a shark. Hmm. Hmm. Mommy Bus can't see anything. Don't worry, Buster. Everything is fine. And Mommy Bus is going back to her nap. Buster is still very scared. I wonder if the shark is still there. Ah! It's a shark! Go, Buster, go! Oops! Not again! Buster is still frightened, but he wants to get over his fear. He's going back again. There's the shark. Wait a second, what's wrong? <gasps> the shark has a sore, wobbly tooth! That's why it was jumping out of the water! 
Don't worry, Shark. Buster can help. He's trying to get Mommy's attention. She's awake. She's got her red kit and Mommy Bus to the rescue. Splat! <laughs> yum, yum! Mommy Bus is removing the shark's wobbly tooth. It's out! Hooray! The shark feels so much better now. Well done, Buster! He can't wait to show the tooth to his friends. It's Buster the Bus and Scout the Little Car. They're playing basketball together. Nice work, guys. Oh dear, Buster is very tired. It's been a long day. Now it's getting late. Time to go home and rest his sleepy head. Now Buster can sleep and dream the night away. What will he dream of tonight, I wonder? Oh, look! It's Twinkle, the star! She helps everyone sleep peacefully through until morning. Twinkle's going to give Buster sweet dreams. Whoa! Buster's a rocket in space! He can fly about through the stars and float through the night sky. Awesome! There's Twinkle again. They can explore space together. What fun! Look, there are some shooting stars. Whoa! And there are some big floating asteroids. I think Twinkle's playing hide and seek. There she is. Where's she leading Buster to now? Look, the moon. It's bright yellow. Buster is having so much fun playing out in space. Wow, it's Mars, the red planet. There's a little space buddy coming out to play. I think Buster's frightened, but it's okay. Space buddy just wants to make friends. Now they can bounce up and down together. Making new friends is the best. Buster's had such a fun time playing with Twinkle and Space Buddy. But now it's time to go back home to Earth. Buster's coming into land. Ah, Buster, what an amazing dream. Thanks, Twinkle. Good night. Today, let's look at the top five Buster costumes. Number five, Superhero Buster. Oh wow, you've turned into a superhero. You are so fast. Super Buster is here, woohoo! This doesn't look good. Oh no, he's pushed the boulder over the edge and trapped Otis in the tunnel. It's okay, Buster, you're a superhero now. You can save him. Oh, Buster, your eyes. Wow, you have laser vision. Well done, Buster. You've set Otis free. Number four. Rainbow Buster. Wow, Buster made the scout rainbow colored. Now he's rainbow colored too. It's Buster the Rainbow Bus. It's Terry again. Now it's Rainbow Terry. And look at all the fields and the barn. Rainbow colors everywhere. Amazing. Buster even turned the clouds different colors. There's just one thing missing. A rainbow, of course. The rainbow bus is driving off over the rainbow. Bye-bye. Number three. Buster the fire truck. <laughs> wow, look at that. Buster really is a fire truck. He's got a ladder, a siren, and a water hose. Uh-oh, the fire alarm. There's a fire somewhere. Quick, Buster the fire truck, put that fire out. Uh-oh, the fire has spread to the roof. You can do it if you work together. Two fire trucks are better than one. Phew, the fire is out at last. Nice work, Buster and Ashley. <laughs> Number two, Zombie Buster. This is spooky. And what's happened to Buster? I think that green slime has changed Buster into a zombie. Who's that? Oh no, it's Zombie Buster. Digger is really frightened. Oh no, Scout is hiding from Buster. <gasps> Poor Buster is so upset and lonely. Do you see 
now, Buster? You look like a zombie. That's why everyone is scared of you. Don't worry, Buster. Look, the slime has come off on Scout's wheel. A car wash? Good idea, Scout. Buster always loves a car wash. Yay, the green has gone. Number one, Cowboy Buster. Hey there, Buster. Oh, wow, look at that. You're in the Wild West. <laughs> and check out your cowboy hat. Oh, look, a lasso. Wait, <gasps> it's Bandit Bus. And what's that on his back? A sack. I think he's robbed the sweet shop. They're speeding alongside the train tracks. Bandit is trying to lose Buster in the cactus field. One, two, three, go! Great, you did it! You caught Bandit. Oh, wow, Sheriff Buster. Wow, Buster really has some amazing costumes. Look, it's Buster and Scout. They're playing in the snow. They're having so much fun jumping and sliding around. Hello, Mr. Snowman. Oh my, what has Scout seen? She looks very excited. I wonder what it is, Buster. Oh, wow, it's a frozen pond. Look at Scout skating on the ice. She's very good, isn't she, Buster? Come on, Buster, why don't you give it a try? Whoop, careful. Aw, oh, poor Buster. The ice is very slippery. It hasn't seemed to stop Scout. Look at her go. I think Buster is scared of the slippy ice. Come on, Buster. There's no need to be afraid. Ha-ha, there you go. You'll get the hang of it. Off Buster goes, skating around the pond. <laughs> He's really going for it. They're both having so much fun skating on the ice. Well done, Buster. Scout seems very impressed. Oh, wow, look at Buster flying through the air. Look, you've cracked the ice. The ice is cracking even more. And it's cracked around Scout. She's trapped. Buster, what are you going to do? If you go any closer, the ice will surely break. Great idea. Mr. Snowman won't break the ice. Please, will you help Mr. Snowman? Look at him go. He's saving Scout. Well done, Mr. Snowman. And nice quick thinking, Buster. I don't think Buster and Scout will be doing any more skating. Thanks, Mr. Snowman. Bye, Buster. Buster and his friends look so excited. What's going on? Oh, wow. Mommy has set up an Easter egg hunt for them. What's that? I think Scout is really excited about having some yummy chocolate. Ready and go. Everyone's going to look for the Easter eggs. Oops. Try not to bump into each other. Nice! Ash found an egg in that tree. He's rushing back and putting it in the basket so they can all share it later. Good job, Ash. Ooh, I think Buster has seen an egg too. Wait, this is just the wrapping paper. Where's the chocolate egg gone? Buster's disappointed. But look, there's another egg by the bush. Hmm, this one's just wrapping too. Someone has taken the chocolate. Very strange. Oh dear, Ash is worried. They haven't found enough eggs to share around. But it's okay, they'll just have to keep looking. What's this? Another empty bit of wrapping. There's Bandit. He's sneaky. Maybe he's been stealing all the chocolate? He's got some eggs. But look, he's putting them in the basket. It's not Bandit who's stealing them. Look, there goes Scout. She'll know what to do. But wait. Is that chocolate around Scout's mouth? She's the one stealing all the eggs. Look, Scout hid all the eggs she found behind that bush. She loves chocolate so much, she wanted them all to herself. But she's very sorry. She knows sharing is the right thing to do. Buster forgives her, but they'd better clean that chocolate off her face. 
There. Mommy can share them out equally. Ash, Bandit, Buster, Scout. Everyone gets some yummy Easter eggs. Wakey, wakey, Buster. It's a brand new day. Wait a minute. There's no color. That's strange. Even Robin doesn't have any color. Look, Robin. Buster made you colorful again. Well done, Buster. <laughs> oh no, that baby duckling looks sad. She's lost her color. Maybe Buster can help. Great job! The color is back again. Oh, look how happy the duckling is now. Oh look, Terry's farm has lost its color too. Can Buster help? <laughs> he sure can. You've got the magic touch, Buster. <laughs> oh no, not Scout too. Go on, Buster. Help her be colorful again. There you go, Scout. Back to normal. Look, Buster can change the color of things too. Now the ball is green. And now the ball is purple. Buster knows how to color things in. Wow! Buster made Scout rainbow colored. Now he's rainbow colored too. It's Buster the Rainbow Bus. It's Terry again. Now it's Rainbow Terry. And look at all the fields! And the barn! Rainbow colors everywhere! Amazing! Buster even turned the clouds different colors. There's just one thing missing. A rainbow, of course! The rainbow bus is driving off over the rainbow. Bye-bye! Oh, Buster, it was only a dream. And it's raining outside. Oh, I'm sorry, Buster. Wait! Maybe you're magic after all, Buster. You made the sun it's come It's evening out. time, and Buster's cousin Bandit is coming for a sleepover. <laughs> this is going to be so much fun. First, it's time for a snack. I wonder what it will be. Oh, wow! Cookies! They look so tasty! Buster and Bandit love cookies. There, one each. <laughs> Yummy. Now Mommy's put them away. But Bandit knows where they are. Bandit and Buster have such a fun evening playing together. But then it's time for bed. They want to stay up longer. But Mommy says no. Hmm, I think Bandit has an idea. I wonder what he's whispering. Now, everyone's fast asleep. But what's this? Bandit's waking up. Buster, too. They're sneaking back downstairs. Oh, Bandit is going to steal some more cookies. That's very naughty. Oops, that made a loud noise. <gasps> Mommy's caught them. <laughs> She's very disappointed in Buster and Bandit. Oh. The two little buses are very sorry. They'll go back to bed now as they're told. <laughs> but the next morning, Buster and Bandit have surprised Mommy by making breakfast. They wanted to show how sorry they were. Buster looks so excited. I wonder why. A storybook. Buster wants Mommy to read to him. Buster loves a good fairy tale. Mommy's reading Buster the story of Goldilocks and the three bears. When the bears had gone out, Goldilocks came to the window. She tried their porridge, but the first bowl was too hot. Buster thinks that's very funny. But look at the time. Mommy can't read all day. Buster's upset. He wants to know what happens next in the story. But Mommy knows what to do. Maybe Grandpa can read to Buster? 
Grandpa is out watering the plants, but Buster wants him to read more of the storybook. Yes, Grandpa can read to him for a bit. He loves stories of great adventures and brave heroes. What's happening now? Goldilocks sits on a chair that's too small, and it breaks. How funny. Buster loves this story. But what's this? Mommy says it's time for dinner. The rest of the story will have to wait. Buster has some nice fish fingers and vegetables for dinner, but he's eating them all really fast. He wants to get back to the story as soon as possible. Hmm, Mommy and Grandpa are still eating. They can't read to him right now. Buster really wants to know what happens next. Look, he's trying to read it himself. He's not very good at reading, but he's trying really hard. Wow, he's getting it. Mommy and Grandpa are so proud of him. Good job, Buster. But oh dear, he's getting sleepy too. Mommy's reading the book to Buster as a bedtime story. Now Goldilocks is asleep in the bear's bed. Oh look, Buster has fallen asleep. Aw, he'd had such a busy day, he couldn't stay awake for the end. Good night, Buster. Look, Buster has arrived early for school today. There's Scout and Diggly. Whoops, Buster slipped on some oil. Oh dear, the blackboard is wrecked. Scout flipped too. Phew! Oh no, the clock is broken too. What a mess. And here comes the teacher. They'll need to clean everything up really quick. But the board is too heavy for Scout, and Diggly can't pick up the letters. Buster tries to fix the clock, but there are so many pieces. I think Buster has a plan. They can swap jobs. Scout can collect up all the letters, then Diggly and Buster can lift the blackboard together. Scout knows her ABCs. She can put the letters back. Now for the clock. Diggly can fix that. He loves fixing machines. There, all done. Just in time, here comes the teacher. Well? Everything looks normal. Apart from that letter. And the time isn't right. And the number. One, two, three, four. Good as near comes Buster the Bus. I wonder what he's going to get up to today. What's this? Look at that billboard, Buster. Those tires look so shiny and new. Maybe it's time for you to get some new tires, Buster. <laughs> Off he goes. Oh, look. It's Jessie the Jeep. She seems to be struggling up the hill. Here comes Buster. Poor Jessie. I think she needs some help, Buster. Her tires don't seem to be gripping the road. You're nearly there, Jessie. Keep trying. Oh, Buster, I know you want to get those tires, but your friend Jessie needs some help. Oh, no! Jessie is slipping back down. Aw, oh, well done, Buster! You came back to help Jessie. That was very kind of you. Oh, no! It looks like something is wrong with Jessie's trailer. It looks like the weight of the trailer is pushing her down the hill too fast. She's lost control, Buster. Quickly, Buster, you have to help her. It'll be okay, Jessie. Buster isn't far behind. Good job, Buster. Keep in control of the trailer so it doesn't tip over. Oh, no. The garage is up ahead. She won't be able to slow down in time. Great idea, Buster. Use your brakes to slow down, Jessie. That was a close one. Well done, Buster. And look, it's the shiny new tires you came for. Oh, poor Jessie. Her tires look sore. 
Buster, I think there's someone who needs them more than you. <gasps> That's right, Buster. Well done. <laughs> Jesse really needs some new tires. <laughs> they look great, Jesse. You'll have no trouble pulling your trailer now. And driving up hills will be easy. <laughs> Bye, Buster. <laughs> Bye, Jesse. Wow, Buster. Look at that red balloon. Why don't you try and catch it? <laughs> nice try, Buster. But it's floating away. Aw, Buster looks sad. <laughs> oh, hey, little Robin. You might be able to catch the runaway red balloon. There we go. <laughs> Thanks, Robin. That's a nice-looking balloon, Buster. <laughs> oh, wow, there's another balloon. This one is green. <laughs> Quick, Robin, catch it. There we go. Now you have two balloons, Buster. Gosh, look at all those colorful balloons. You know what to do, Robin. <laughs> Buster! The balloons are lifting you off the ground. Robin has lost Buster. He's up there, Robin. Buster's flying. It's okay, Buster. Don't be scared. Look at the view from up here. <laughs> Terry can't work out where that horn is coming from. Look up there, Terry. Is it a bird? Is it a plane? No, it's Buster the bus. <laughs> There's something you don't see every day. Oh, Buster, you're floating quite high now. Terry looks so small down there on the ground. I think Buster is starting to get scared. You don't want to end up in space, Buster. Robin, you've got to help. Great idea. If you pop the balloons, huh? Buster will hopefully float down. Oh, no, oh, Buster's falling yeah. really quickly. It's okay, Buster. You've nearly reached the ground. I think a few more balloons will do it, Robin. And touchdown. Buster is pleased to be back on the ground. I think we should leave the flying to Robin, Buster. Oh, where's Robin going? Huh, <laughs> <laughs> another balloon? I think Buster has had enough of balloons for one day. Bye, Buster. <laughs> Bye, Robin. Buster is packing his bag for Ash's birthday picnic. He will need a picnic blanket, something to drink. What else does Buster need? Marshmallows to toast on the fire. Thanks, Daddy Bus. Don't forget Ash's present. Buster is so excited to celebrate Ash's birthday. What's wrong, Buster? He looks a bit unwell. He really doesn't want to miss the party. Buster and Daddy have arrived. Time to play some party games together. Hmm, Buster really doesn't look well. But he doesn't want to miss out on the fun. They're playing hide and seek. Oh no, Buster is feeling really poorly. Maybe sitting by the fire will make him feel better? His friends are worried about him and want to make sure he's okay. Maybe some marshmallows will make him feel better. He can't even eat toasted marshmallows. Daddy Bus is taking Buster home to rest. But he can't forget Ash's birthday present. What is it? It's a painting set. That's very thoughtful, Buster. It's given Ash an idea. He's passing a paintbrush to Bandit and Scout. I wonder what they're going to paint. Buster is resting at home. He isn't his usual happy self. He needs to take his medicine and get some sleep to feel better. Well done, Buster. The next day, Buster is feeling a bit better now. But he's still sad he missed Ash's birthday. 
Oh. Daddy Bus has got Buster some warm soup. And what's that? His friends made a painting for him. Oh. And they're outside! Hooray! Buster is so happy to see his friends. And the painting has made him feel much better. It's a sunny day at Buster's house. Oh, look! Mommy Bus is helping a kitten with a sore leg. There, all fixed and bandaged up. Scout is here to drive to school with Buster. They are playing in the playground. Oh, dear! Scout hurt her tire. Buster's got an idea. What is he up to? He's bandaged up Scout's tire with toilet roll. All fixed! Great work, Buster! Looks like Ash wants to be bandaged up as well. And now Scout wants her other tires bandaged up. But Buster is all out of toilet roll. Bandit has a cheeky idea. <laughs> They're all taking the toilet roll. They're getting the toilet roll everywhere. This looks very messy. They're getting a bit carried away. Oh dear, they've covered the playground in toilet roll. Teacher doesn't seem very pleased. <laughs> Mommy Bus is here to take Buster home. She wonders what has upset the teacher. Buster explains he was trying to help Scout like Mommy helped the kitten. Mommy will be able to bandage it properly. Time to get properly fixed up. It's me, Super Buster! The bravest boss in the whole world! And Speedy Scout, the fastest race car in history! And Professor Excavator, the digger with the ginormous brain! <laughs> Ooh! Aw, oh, I wish I could fly! But I'm not so good with heights. Hmm. Come with me. Professor Excavator has a cunning plan. <laughs> Behold, my greatest invention yet. The Excavator Turbo Flyer. Uh, Diggly. Professor Excavator. Sorry, Professor Excavator. Uh, this is a trailer? That won't fly. Not in a million billion Trillion years! But this isn't just a trailer, it's a big, balloon powered cloud bouncer! Ugh! <gasps> <laughs> 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 Bandit! Whoa! Hmm? These balloons are cool! We should fill them with water and have a water fight! Leave them, Bandit! We're trying to fly! But I'm Super Buster. Super Buster isn't afraid of heights. Get me down. I don't like heights. Buster, help. How do we get down? Uh, <laughs> I didn't think of that. Uh, <laughs> we'll think of something. Just don't look down. 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 Ah, I look down. By my calculations, they can blow all the way into space. Uh, we can do this with a bumper bunch. Aha! Uh -huh. Buster, catch! Ooh, aha! Uh -huh. ah! ah! Bandit, pop some balloons. I'm scared. I can't move! You can be brave, Bandit. You can do it. We both can. Ah! Ah! <laughs> Stand back! Stand back! Turbo Flyer coming into land! <laughs> Whoa! Uh -oh. 
faced our fears. That's awesome. And it turns out buses can fly. Buster and his friends are back at school. They are telling each other what they got up to over the summer. Buster is ah. so excited to tell everyone about his shark tooth. <laughs> but first, Scout is telling everyone what she got up to over the summer. This summer, I went surfing for the first time ever. It was so cool. There was this one wave I saw that was absolutely massive. But I still got to surf it without falling off. And I went so fast! Scoot, scoot! Wow! Scout told such a cool story! Huh. What's wrong with Buster? Mm. Oh, he thinks his shark tooth story won't be interesting enough after Scout's story. Hmm. Buster is going to tell everyone how he got the tooth. This summer, I went exploring in the deep, dark wood. <laughs> It's full of animals and monsters, but I wasn't afraid one bit. <laughs> ah. Oh. Huh? But then, hmm. I came face to face with a dinosaur. Hmm? <gasps> but he had a oh. sore tooth. Hmm. So I took it out for him to make him feel all better. Ah. Wait a second, that's not right. Dinosaurs are extinct. Oh dear, Bandit thinks Buster isn't telling the truth. He couldn't really meet a dinosaur, could he? All right, it's not really a dinosaur tooth. It's a shark tooth. I thought that wouldn't be interesting enough. But Buster, sharks are way cooler than dinosaurs. Go Buster, tell us the story. <laughs> this summer, I was at the beach, but then I saw, mm. no. Yes, oh. pirates are even cooler than sharks. <laughs> Yarm a hearty. <laughs> hmm. Okay, the pirates and me, we found a shark, but he had a sore tooth. So we decided oh. to take the tooth hmm. out with a little help from a friendly little bee. <laughs> we took out the sore tooth and then they played catch with it. Gotcha! <laughs> and they played on the beach all day long. What a great story! It's so much fun to use your imagination. <laughs> Especially with friends. Well, Buster, it looks like you're all covered in mud. You had a lot of fun splashing through those muddy puddles. It looks like Buster might need a wash. I'm not sure if he thinks so. Here comes the city bus. Oh dear, he doesn't look very impressed at how dirty Buster is. It looks like Buster has finally realized just how messy he looks. That's right, Buster. You're covered in mud. Is that a sign for a car wash? <laughs> Great idea, Buster. Off he goes to the car wash to clean himself up. Oh, poor Buster. He's too scared to go inside. It does look very scary, doesn't it? Go on, Buster. You can do it. You need to get clean. You're so dirty. He's going for it. Buster is being very brave indeed. One, two, three. Oh no, you were so close, Buster. Oh, he sounds very impatient. Buster, take a deep breath. You can do it. But the sounds are so scary. Go on, Buster, you can do it. You're almost there. Ready, set, go! <laughs> You're doing it, Buster! It tickles. That's not so bad, is it? And out he comes. There, that wasn't so bad, was it, Buster? All sparkly and clean. Looking good. Wow, well done, Buster. Nice and clean. 
That car wash wasn't so scary after it's all. It's Buster's birthday. <laughs> Mommy and Grandpa are setting up a very special party. <laughs> Don't eat the food yet, Buster. You've got to wait until your guests arrive. Oh, look, here they are. It's Scout, Ash, and Bandit. Everyone's so excited for the party. What's Bandit up to? Hmm, that cake looks yummy. Not yet, Bandit. First, we're playing party games. They're playing musical statues. They have to dance until the music stops. Great move, Scout. And freeze. Oh no, Scout is losing balance. And so is Buster. They are out of the game. It's only Bandit and Ash left. And dance! Bandit is losing balance! Oh no! He knocked Ash over so he could win. And now Ash is out of the game. But Grandpa didn't see Bandit cheating. Hmm, that wasn't very nice, Bandit. Now they're playing past the parcel. They pass the present, and when the music stops, they can take off the wrapping paper. Oh. Hooray for Ash! <gasps> Bandit has cheated again! He took the parcel after the music stopped. <laughs> Poor Ash! Bandit isn't playing very fair. Buster is telling Bandit that he's making Ash feel upset. He needs to think about how his actions affect the feelings of others. It's time for some birthday cake. Blow out the candles. Go, Buster. What a feast. All the delicious food has been eaten. Well, almost. Don't worry, Ash. Have some birthday cake. Bandit feels really bad for making Ash sad. Bandit is really sorry and gives Ash his ball back. It's okay, Bandit. Ash forgives you. But remember, it's not all about the winning. It's about having fun together. Buster's kindness saved the party. Happy birthday, Buster. Buster, Scout, Bandit, and Ash are having a race. Buster and Bandit are neck and neck. But Scout's dashed into the lead. Whoosh! Scout won! Nice work, Scout. She really is super speedy. What's that noise? Thunder? Oh no, it's a storm! They should take cover or they'll get all wet. Whoa, that was close. Ash nearly skidded into his friends on the wet grass. Wait a minute, that gives Buster an idea. Whoosh, skidding through those muddy puddles is great fun. They could play a game, see who can skid the furthest. What a great idea. Bandit is going first. Swish, he skidded all the way over there. But Scout thinks she can do better. Vroom. Whoa, Scout went even further than Bandit. <laughs> now it's Ash's turn. <laughs> he's so little, he's spinning round and round. He's all dizzy, but he's gone the furthest yet. Last up, it's Buster. Whoosh. Uh-oh, he's getting out of control. Whoa! Oops, Buster splashed Mommy with mud. Looks like it's time for all the little vehicles to get back home. They're back at Buster's house in no time. But wait, they can't go inside until they're all cleaned up. Mommy's going to use the hose to wash all the mud off. Splish splash!
<laughs> there. Now all four of them are clean again. But even so, that skidding race was so much fun. How exciting! Buster's off! Oh no! The boat wasn't tied to the dock! The river is carrying Buster away! Daddy Bus to the rescue! Uh-oh! That boat has a leak! Oh! There's a bridge! Buster's grabbing on! Phew! Oh no! The pole broke off! Look out! Uh-oh! Buster has spotted rocks ahead! Good thinking, Buster! Oh no! The pole snapped! And look! A waterfall ahead! What's Daddy pointing to? A rope! Perfect! The waterfall isn't far away now! You can do it! Go, Buster! Nice throw! Daddy Bus is pulling Buster back to the shore! Nearly there! Just a bit further! Phew! Back on dry land! Now Buster and Daddy are fishing instead! That's much more relaxing! Hey there, Buster! Looks like a hot day out in the desert! Whoa! Look at that ahead! A big mountain with smoke rising from the top! What was that? It's Frida the sports car! She's speeding off toward the smoky mountain! I think she wants to race! Buster and Rita are speeding across the desert together! Rita is faster! Go on, Buster! You can do it! Buster is using that ramp to jump after Rita! Phew! That was a fun race to the top! But look! What's that? Hot molten lava! I think this is a volcano! It could erupt at any moment! Uh-oh, Buster! Careful of that rock! Oh no! It's fallen into the lava! Phew! Nothing happened! Oh no! I think the volcano is erupting! Quick, guys! Get out of there! Oh no! There are fireballs shooting out of the volcano! Look out! They'll be really hot! Oh no! Rita is stuck in the sand! Buster is being brave and going to help his new friend! Great job, Buster! Now quickly, drive away! Faster! Faster! Phew! That was a close one! Here's Ashley the fire truck. She doesn't look pleased. She's going to have to put out all the fire. Buster and Rita aren't saying anything. They didn't mean to set the volcano off. That was close, but Buster made a brand new friend along the way. Bye, Buster. Bye, Rita. It's a sunny day, and Daddy Bus is taking Buster on a trip to the beach. Buster says goodbye to Mommy Bus, and off they go! Hooray! But oh dear! Otis is blocking their path! The road is closed! Buster is very upset! But looks like Daddy has an idea! It's a lovely lake! And they can go fishing instead! Buster is disappointed though, as he wanted to go to the beach! Daddy teaches him how to fish! Wow! Now it's Buster's turn! Buster is bored! This isn't as fun as the beach! Why is Daddy so excited? Hang on! Something is tugging on Daddy's line! What could it be? Whoa! Daddy has caught a huge fish! It's so big, Daddy isn't strong enough! Buster joins in and helps! Watch out, Buster! Oops! They've been pulled into the water! And the fish is finding this very funny! Buster and Daddy Bus won't give up that easily! 
Looks like they've got a new plan. The fish is swimming in the lake. Daddy casts his fishing line. And the fish pulls once again. It's another tug of war. Look, there's Buster floating in the lake. Aha, gotcha. Buster caught the fish with his net. <laughs> Go, Buster. Daddy is very proud. Well done, Buster. The fish swims away. See you next time, fishy. Fishing was lots of fun after all. It's Buster. Time to wake up. <laughs> it's a bright new day. <laughs> Look, Mommy has made Buster's breakfast already. Jam on toast. Buster's favorite. Ouch! Buster drove over that toy. It's okay. Mommy can kiss it all better. There. Now Buster can go out and play soccer. How exciting. Now Buster is playing in the park with Scout. Nice one, Scout. But oh no! The soccer ball has gotten stuck in the tree. But look! Mommy has knocked the ball free again. Well done, Mommy. Now they can keep on playing. What's this? Mommy and Buster are painting a picture. It's so much fun to paint together. Look, the sun has a face. <laughs> but oh dear, Buster is sleepy. It's been such a busy day. Time for Buster to go to bed now. First, Mommy reads Buster a bedtime story. Aw, good night, Buster. It was so much fun spending the day playing with Mommy. She really is the best. <laughs> Look, it's Buster. And he's having fun playing in the muddy puddles. And who's this? It's Cozy Coop. Buster loves making new friends. He wants Cozy to play with him. Cozy's a bit shy. But Buster encourages Cozy. Playing in the muddy puddles is so much fun. Cozy jumps in. Hooray! Now they're playing together. Hop, hop, hop through the muddy puddles. Splish, splash, splash. That was great fun. But now they're all muddy. Time to head off to the car wash to get cleaned up. There it is. Buster's going to show Cozy how the car wash works. Buster turns it on, the rollers spin, and in they go. But wait, that's not right. They're still muddy. The car wash didn't clean them. Something must be wrong. Buster goes to take a closer look. Cozy tries pushing some buttons. Oops! The roller bonks Buster on the head. And what's this? The water button? Uh-oh. What's that noise? Splash! Buster and Cozy got all wet. But they're still all muddy, too. Something still isn't right with the car wash. Cozy goes in, and Buster looks at the controls. There. Uh-oh. The lever is stuck. Buster can't turn it off. Whoa! Look at all those bubbles. Phew! Otis the police car turned the car wash off. Now Buster and Cozy are clean at last. But look! Otis is all covered in bubbles. Who grow up, each of you will have a part to play in the community. Dream big. What will you be? You could be a firefighter, a doctor, or best of all, a teacher like me. <laughs> or you could be a race car and take part in all the big high-speed races. There's so much we could be. 
a firefighter, a space explorer? I want to be a, a, a lighthouse. What about you, Scout? I want to be a race car. Speedy Scout, winner of the big race. That's awesome, Scout. I bet you'll be the fastest race car in history. And I'm going to be the race talk guy. It's Speedy Scout, ready for the big race. And there's her helper, Buster. Here's the world champion, the most awesomest race car in the whole world. It's Chase Octane, the turbo car. You can do it, Scout. Ready, steady, go, 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 go. Can you hear me, Scout? Loud and clear. Quick, take that right turn. It's a shortcut. No, that's a left turn. My bad. Woohoo! I'm faster than a rocket! Huh? Oh no! Buster! I have a flat tyre! Don't worry, Scout, I'm coming! Sorry, excuse me, sorry! Hard ah! ah! Buster? Mm. I got a tyre! <laughs> It's too late. I'll never catch Octane. Sure you can. If anyone can catch him, it's Speedy Scout. Mm. <laughs> Here comes Speedy Scout, out of nowhere. The excitement, the speed. Race! <laughs> I knew you could do it, Scout! Thanks! I couldn't have done it without you! <laughs> Buster is excited to spend the day with Grandpa! And Grandpa's looking at a beautiful cake! Grandpa has an idea! They should bake the cake together! Buster and Grandpa have come to the supermarket to get the ingredients. Flour, eggs, milk, and icing sugar. Uh. <laughs> Oop, who's that? It's Mira! Along with Terry. Buster rushes to get the ingredients. But Grandpa warns him not to be hasty. Buster's looking for flour. Bingo! He's found it! And so has Mira! Uh-oh! Looks like they've got the same list of ingredients. Whoa! They both want the same bag! Oops! Mira and Buster are in the race to find out who gets all the ingredients first. Buster's come to get the milk. He got it first. Off he goes, Mira. Whoops. Mira, you spooked the teacher. <laughs> she grabbed some milk, too. Slow down, you guys. Whoa. It's Grandpa and Terry. Both of them move very slowly. <laughs> you sure are smart and sly, Buster. Off they go again. Oh, look! There are the eggs! Oh, no! Buster dropped the eggs! And... Mira spotted the last bag of icing sugar. Mira sprints off to get it. But, oh no! Mira lost balance and crashed into the shelf! Buster grabs the last bag of icing sugar. But Mira's upset. 
Buster offers her the icing sugar, and she wants him to have it. Grandpa and Terry are surprised to see Mira in a mess. Buster's got a plan. Aw, looks like Buster and Mira shared the icing sugar to bake one big cake. The cake tastes delicious. Great teamwork, Mira and Buster. Buster, it's time to get ready for school. I don't want to go back to school. <sighs> What's wrong, Buster? I made your favorite breakfast for your first day back. I'm just not that hungry, Mum. It's not like you, Buster. Are you nervous about going back to school? No, I'm not. Well, I mean a little, maybe. You'll enjoy it when you get there, and you'll get to see all your friends. I guess so. Here's your lunch. Hmm. I can't wait to see everyone, and to get to class. I wonder what we'll learn today. I'm excited. I'm hungry. Hey, Scout. Hey, Buster. Hey, Diggly. Buster, are you coming? Uh, I'll, I'll catch you guys up. But Buster, I've calculated a current speed so long as there's no traffic, we only have one minute to spare to get to class on time. And I'm the fastest. I can catch you guys up. Don't worry. Slow coach. I'm not a coach. I'm a digger. Welcome back to school, kids. Did you all have a good holiday? <laughs> <laughs> so, today we are going to learn about road safety. Who knows what the colours of the traffic lights mean? Me, me, me! Let's start with the red one. Me, me, me! I do! Uh, Bandit, do you know? Uh, me, me, me! Diggly? Stop! Correct! Well done! The orange one, a uh, scout. Wait! Ugh. Well done! And finally, Buster, the green one. Go! Go, Buster! <laughs> yes, well done! So, who wants to practice driving towards the traffic light as I point at each one? Red for stop, orange for slow and wait, and green for go. Go, Buster! <laughs> okay, Buster, are you ready? What's this? You should have been concentrating, Buster, rather than showing off to your friends. I'm sorry. Scout. Diggly. Well done, Bandit. <laughs> oh, you can share mine. Are you sure? Of course. <laughs> hey, give it back. I'll get your lunch back, Scout. <gasps> Diggly, the lights! <gasps> <gasps> Phew. Thanks, Buster. You saved me. You just have to concentrate, Diggly. <laughs> like teacher says. I'm sorry. I shouldn't have taken your things. I just wanted to play with you guys. Thanks for saying sorry. You can play with us, Bandit. You just need to ask. Really? Of course. Because I'm still the fastest. <laughs> <laughs> mum, mum, mum! 
<laughs> Did you have a good day? Were you nervous at school? Nah, but I ate my lunch on the way to school and I was trying to show off and fail the lesson. But then, when Bandit took Scout's lunch, I raced after Diggly and stopped him right before he went through the red light and crashed into the barrier. Well done, I'm proud of you, Buster. Can I go out and play? Of course you can. Come on, Bandit. Join in and be on my side. <laughs> Buster the bus and Scout the car are playing soccer. Buster shoots. Goal! Well done, Buster. Great work. Whoa, it's a soccer bus. He plays for the big bus soccer team. He wants Buster to come try out for the team. But oh no, Buster is too shy. Scout encourages him and Buster says okay. He'll come to the big game tomorrow. Scout is very proud of her friend, but Buster is still nervous. That night, Buster is sleeping peacefully in his garage. Buster dreams he's playing on the big bus soccer team. The game starts, but oh dear, the buses play rough. Now it's Buster's turn in goal. He tries to save it, but oh dear, the soccer buses don't look very impressed. Poor Buster, he's tried so hard. Phew, it was just a bad dream. But now Buster's even more nervous about trying out for the team. Scout does her best to encourage him. Buster can do it. She believes in him. <laughs> now it's time for the big game. Robin blows his whistle and the game begins. Oh no, the red bus has been injured. They can't play anymore. Buster will have to step in. Go on, Buster, you can do it. Buster kicks the ball and the game goes on. Buster is going in goal now. The blue bus takes a shot and... Buster saved it! Well done, Buster! You did so well! Hooray! That was so much fun! You're looking very cheerful today, Buster. What's that you've seen? Oh, wow! A kitten! It's adorable! Careful, Buster. You're really big, and the cat is really small. Oh, dear. I think you scared her, Buster. I wonder where she's going. You're too big to go under the fence, Buster. You'll have to go around. Where's that kitten gotten to? Uh-oh. She's stuck up in that tall tree. You've got to rescue her, Buster. A trampoline? What a good idea. That'll be a nice soft landing for the kitten. Bounce? Oh no, the kitten bounced right the way back up into the tree. Let's try something else. A net? Good idea, Buster. Careful now, gently, gently. Oh look, a bee. Stay still, Buster. I don't think he means any harm, but... Oh, dear. The net is broken, too. Back to the drawing board. Hold on. I think Buster has another idea. Of course! Buster's brought Ashley the fire truck. She'll be able to reach the kitten with her tall ladder. There we go. <laughs> the kitten will be safe now. Oh no, I think the kitten is too scared to come down the ladder. I wonder what Buster has planned. Oh yes, the kitten's ball of wool. She'll come down to play with that. Look how happy the kitten is. Here she comes down the ladder. There, safe and sound. Nice work, Buster. Buster, wake up. There's a snowflake. That can only mean one thing. It must be snowing. Wow, it is snowing. <laughs> Whee! But wait, where's the Christmas tree? That one won't do, <sighs> will it? Oh, look, it's a friendly robin. I wonder what he's saying. 
I think he wants Buster to follow him. Hmm? Oh, he wants to help Buster find a new Christmas tree. Hmm, these ones aren't quite right. Wow, that one looks amazing. Hmm. Buster certainly agrees. That's a tall tree, isn't it, Buster? <laughs> Careful does it, Buster. Whoop, it's wobbling. It's wobbling. Keep going, Buster. Whoa! There we go. <laughs> Off Buster goes to carry it back to the garage. I'm not sure if that will fit. It looks very big. Be careful with the turns, Buster. Oh no, behind you, Buster, you've lost the tree. Look behind you. Quick, 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 hurry, Buster, turn around. Oh no, the tree is bouncing away. Quick, Buster, see if you can catch up with it. Now it's bouncing through all of the Christmas lights. <gasps> quick, Buster, do you think Buster's going to make it? Look at it, flying through the air. Go on, Buster. Lucky you, Buster. That's a relief. <laughs> it looks amazing. Oh, look, here's Terry. Here's Scout. They've come to celebrate the holidays with Buster. Well done, and happy holidays. It's Cozy Coop at the sweet shop, and they've bought some tasty sweets. Now here comes Scout. She wants to get some sweets, too. They look tasty, but uh-oh. It's that mean old bully, Bandit Bus. He's stolen Scout's sweets and eaten them. How mean of him. Poor Scout. <laughs> Meanwhile, Cozy visits Buster in the park, where Buster is playing with his soccer ball. Cozy wants to share the sweets with Buster. But oh no, it's Bandit again. He's stolen the sweets and eaten them himself. And now he's seen the soccer ball. <laughs> Bandit has stolen it! Aw, poor Cozy is so upset. They got those sweets especially for their friend. But what's Buster doing? He thinks they should follow Bandit and ask for the ball back. It's not right to take things that don't belong to you. Buster and Cozy drive along the road. But what's this? A trail of sweets leading into a cave. That must be where Bandit went. Buster and Cozy are headed inside. They are going to ask for the ball back. Hmm. Look, there's Bandit. But he looks so sad and lonely. Look at all the drawings he's made. Oh, oh dear. Bandit doesn't have any friends. That's why he stole the sweets and the ball. He has nobody to play with. Bandit has noticed Buster and Cozy. Buster asks for the ball back, and Bandit gives it back. He's sorry he made Cozy upset. <laughs> But what's that noise? It's Scout, and she's brought Otis the police car. She tells him that Bandit has been stealing things, and Bandit ends up in jail. But what's this? Buster and Cozy have come to play with him. Stealing is wrong, but they know Bandit is really sorry, and he only wanted some friends. Buster and Daddy Bus are having a day out at the park. Uh-oh, careful, Daddy. They're going to play some soccer together. It's time for kickoff. Buster passes the ball and... Uh-oh, looks like Daddy hasn't quite got the hang of this. But Buster shows him how it's done. Time for a penalty shootout. Buster shoots and he scores. Oh no, Daddy Bus, are you all right? Phew, he's okay. Now it's Buster's turn to be in goal. Daddy looks determined. Whoops, the ball's gone flying up in the air. Oh, look, it's Ash and Mommy Fire Truck. Buster is inviting them to join the game. Great idea, Buster. It's buses versus fire trucks. Let's go. Buster takes the ball. Ash dives in front. Mommy shoots for goal and she misses. Oops. I think Buster has another idea. I wonder what it is. Ash and Buster are teaming up. 
It's now kids versus parents. <laughs> Who's going to win? <laughs> Ash starts. Daddy takes the ball, but Ash tackles him. He passes to Buster. And Buster scores! Go, Buster! <laughs> what great teamwork, everyone! They are both very tired as Daddy drives Buster home after a great day out. Oh, look! It's Mommy Bus! Buster waves goodbye to Daddy Bus. But wait! Buster is giving Daddy Bus the soccer ball! <laughs> he does need the fresh Scout, Bandit, and Ash are having a race! But Scout dashed into the lead! Whoosh! Scout won! Nice work, Scout! She really is super speedy! What's that noise? Thunder? Oh no! It's a storm! Whoosh! Skidding through those muddy puddles is great fun! They could play a game! See who can skid the furthest! Bandit is going first! Swish! He skidded all the way over there! But Scout thinks she can do better! Vroom! Whoa! Scout went even further than Bandit! Now it's Ash's turn! He's so little, he's spinning round and round! He's all dizzy, but he's gone the furthest yet! Last up, it's Buster! Whoosh! Uh-oh, he's skidding out of control! Whoa! Oops! Buster splashed Mommy with mud! Looks like it's time for all the little vehicles to get back home! But wait! They can't go inside until they're all cleaned up! Mommy's going to use the hose to wash all the mud off. <laughs> and there, now all four of them are clean again. But even so, that skidding race was so much fun. It's a bright, sunny day. Buster and Cozy Coop are visiting the beach. They're playing volleyball. And look, Sham the shark wants to play too. Cozy throws the ball to Sham. Oh dear, the ball has popped on Sham's teeth. Whoops! But what's this? Is that a treasure map? Whoa! There's buried treasure! And it's buried on that desert island! But how will they get across the water? I think Buster has an idea! Whoa! Buster has built a ramp out of sand! Whoosh! Oh no! Splash! Buster couldn't jump far enough! I guess they'll have to try something else! What's Cozy seen? A giant lily pad? Maybe they can drift across the water. Uh-oh, Cozy's come to a stop. Cozy tries paddling, but they just go around in circles. Luckily, Sham can push them back to shore. Thanks, Sham! But they're still no closer to the island. But what's this? Sham has a raft! Now they can cross the water in no time! They've reached the island! Now, time to find that treasure! X marks the spot! Is this X the buried treasure? No, that's just some twigs! Is this X the treasure? No, that's just some seaweed! What about this X? Hooray! There's the treasure chest! Well done, Cozy! Look at all that shiny treasure! And look! A golden ball! Now they can play catch again! Well done, everyone! Ash is coming round to play at Buster's house! They're really excited to play some board games! Today's game is Snakes and Ladders! How exciting! And Ash gets to go first! Five and two, that's seven. So Ash moves his counter seven spaces. Now it's Buster's turn. Eight, along the counter goes. Now it's Ash's turn again. Oh wow, he's rolled very well. He's going up a ladder. Now Buster, five. Oh dear, down the snake he goes. Buster's not doing well. Oops, he knocked over his counter. 
What's that? Here comes Grandpa with lots of other toys to play with, but he's dropped them all. Ash is helping to pick them all up. But no one is watching Buster. <gasps> oh no, he moved his counter up. But that's cheating. Oh no, he's moved it to the finish line like he's won the game. Now Ash is back. Looks like the game is over. Buster won. Ash doesn't understand how that happened, but he's happy for his friend. Ah. That's odd. Buster should feel happy he won, but he doesn't feel right. Not right at all. Buster cheated. He didn't win fair and square, so it feels all wrong. But Grandpa knows it's not all about winning. It's playing the game that's the fun part. And now it's Ash's turn. Ash rolls. Whoa, he almost went down the snake. Buster goes down another snake and... <laughs> there, Ash won fair and square. But Buster is happy for his friend. They had so much fun playing together. Buster the bus has come out to play. Watch out for that red paint, Buster. Oh, Buster's driven right through it. Look, Buster, you've painted some red lines with your tires. I think Buster's had an idea. Nice work. You've painted a circle. A circle is round. Huh? It's the same shape as your wheel, Buster. Now you've colored the circle in, Buster. It's a red circle. Oh, hey, Scout. Come and join the fun. We're learning shapes. What shape is Scout painting? It's a square. A blue square. A square has four equal sides. Hey there, Digger. Digger has come to paint shapes with Buster and Scout. <laughs> what shape will Digger paint? Digger isn't quite as fast as Buster and Scout. It's okay, Digger will be finished soon. It's a triangle. A triangle has three sides. A yellow triangle. <laughs> Digger took so long to paint a shape that Buster and Scout have fallen asleep. Wake up, you two. What other shapes can we draw? A green rectangle. Great work, Buster. A gold star. That looks fantastic, Scout. And a lovely pink heart. Digger is painting a diamond. Wow, look at all the colors go. It's a wonderful rainbow diamond. So many different colored shapes. Learning the shapes was so much fun. We made a square, circle, triangle, star, heart, rectangle, and a diamond. Well done, everyone. Everyone is having fun at the Christmas market. There's Buster. He's having a candy apple. So yummy. Whoa, Mommy Bus has a present. Is that for Buster? It is. But Mommy says to wait until Christmas to open the present. Buster doesn't want to wait. He wants to open the present now. <laughs> but he'll have to wait. Oh. Throw the ball to knock down the cans. That's Mommy's favorite game. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Oh. Uh oh. Buster's going to try to look at the present while Mommy is distracted. Buster shouldn't really be doing that. Hmm, what is inside? Here's Bandit. Oh, look out! Oh no, the present is flying off across the market. Quick, they have to get the present back before Mommy notices it's gone. The present is on the ice rink. Quick, Bandit, grab it. 
Poopsie! Buster will have to try and get it now. So close! Ah, so close! Mommy Bus still hasn't noticed the missing present. She's having so much fun! Oh, there's the present! Can Bandit and Buster get it back before Mommy notices? Ah, whoops! Where's the present gone now? Oh, look! The Wonder Wheel! It's Ash! And there's the present! Oh, no! He dropped it! Go, Buster! Great catch! Phew! Well done, Buster! Look! Mommy put all the cans down! Hooray! She won a teddy bear! They've got the present back just in time. <laughs> Mommy is in such a good mood, she's going to let Buster look at the present, if he still wants to. <laughs> but Buster has learned his lesson. He's going to wait. <laughs> it's finally Christmas Day, and Buster can open the present at last. Whoa, it's a new soccer ball. <laughs> That's why it was so bouncy! <laughs> Merry Christmas, Buster! It's time for Buster to go to school! <gasps> he mustn't forget his packed lunch! They're Scout! <laughs> they don't want to be late! But who's this? A little fire truck? Buster is waving hello! <laughs> At school, the teacher has a surprise! This is Ash! He's the new kid in school! Oh. He's going to be joining their class! Ash is going to Buster because he waved hello! He's so excited to have made a new friend already! Now today, the children are going to learn about parking! The teacher is showing them how to do it properly! Now it's their turn to try! Scout's got it! And Buster! Oh! Ash is sticking really close to his new friend! He's following Buster wherever he goes! He doesn't understand Buster is trying to park! Oh dear! I think he's got on Buster's nerves a bit! Buster wanted some space, but Ash didn't understand! At break time, Buster and Scout are playing! Aw, poor Ash has no friends to play with. But Buster and Scout have an idea. Ash can play with them. They're friends now after all. Now they're all playing together. Whoa, good shot, Ash! It's so nice to make new friends! Buster and Diggly are having so much fun playing with that remote-controlled car! Vroom, vroom! Look at it go! Look, there's Mommy! She's coming to tell them lunch is ready! And she's reminding Buster to put his toys away! Buster is putting the controller away, but look, the car is still outside. Now Buster and Diggly are back to carry on playing, but oh no, they can't see the toy car anywhere. Where could it be? Could it be in the toy box? No, maybe it's in the dustbin. No. Maybe it's buried under the autumn leaves. It must be here somewhere. <gasps> Wait, I think Buster has an idea. If they use the control, listen. The car's engine. Where's the noise coming from? <laughs> Under that pile of leaves? Hooray! They found the toy car! 
But wait, now the controller is missing. Where did it go? Oh, there it is. Well spotted, Buster. Now Diggly and Buster can have fun playing with their remote-controlled car again. But this time, they'll remember to put their toys back in the toy box when they're finished with them. Good job. Oh, hey, it's Buster the bus. I wonder what he's doing sitting on top of that snowy mountain. Whoa, Buster is speeding down the mountain. Look at him go. Be careful, Buster. The roads might be slippery. Hey, it's Suki, the train. She's puffing her way down the mountain. Now Suki and Buster are moving side by side. But I wonder who is going to get to the bottom of the mountain first. Buster and Suki are going to race to the bottom. Look at them go. Oh no, giant snowballs have rolled into the road. Look out, Buster. Buster's having to slow down. But Suki can keep going. Now Buster has caught up with Suki. It's neck and neck. What's this? Buster and Suki are taking different ways down the mountain. Suki goes over the bridge. Buster goes under it. Suki's going as fast as she can. Look, the tracks have changed. Suki is taking a shortcut to the finish line. She's speeding into the lead. Here comes Buster, but uh-oh, Suki is almost at the finish line. Buster will need to go super fast to catch her. Wait, I think Buster has an idea. Buster has made a snowboard out of that road sign. Nice job, Buster. Look how fast he can slide down the mountain. Buster's taken the lead. Hooray! Buster came first. Suki is right behind him. What fun that was. Buster and Suki had such a great time racing down the mountain. It's the end of school. And it's time for Scout to return the school flower that she'd been taking care of. Now whose turn is it to take it home and care for it? Hooray! It's Buster's turn! Buster is going really slowly. He wants to make sure he takes good care of the flower. It's time to say goodbye to Scout and Ash. Whoa! Careful, Buster! That was a close one. Buster is so happy to be caring for the flower that he's drawn a picture of it. He's even brought it to dinner. <laughs> I don't think it eats carrots, Buster. It needs water instead to make sure it grows strong. But now it's time for bed. Good night, flower. The next morning, Buster is super excited for school. Careful, Buster. You don't want to knock the flower. Oh, no. The flower has smashed. What is Buster doing? He's hiding it because he's afraid he'll get in trouble. Hmm, Buster is pretending to be ill. But he doesn't have a temperature. Oh, now Mommy understands. Buster doesn't want to go to school with the smashed flower. He thinks he's let everyone down. But Mommy knows what to do. They'll put the flower in a brand new pot. It looks even better than before. There, good as new. Buster returns the flower to class. Everyone is really impressed with its lovely new pot. Good job, Buster. Now it's Ash's turn to take care of it. Hooray! It's Halloween. Ash and Scout are at Buster's house, ready to go trick-or-treating. Whoa, that zombie costume looks amazing. Bandit is not impressed. Boo! Nope, Bandit doesn't want to join in. He thinks dressing up is for babies. Buster, Scout, and Ash head off on their trick-or-treating adventure. Hang on, 
Bandit would really like some Halloween sweets. <gasps> Looks like he's got an idea. <gasps> Bandit has copied Buster's costume. They look exactly the same. He's arrived at Terry's farm looking like Buster. <laughs> Trick or treat? Wow, look at all those sweeties. Oh look, Buster, Ash, and Scout have arrived. Some sweeties for Scout? Some sweeties for Ash? Hang on. Nope, Terry thinks he's already given Buster lots of sweets. But it was actually Naughty Bandit. Poor Buster. Ash and Scout like how they look in their reflections. What is that? A sweet wrapper? And another? It's Bandit eating all the sweets! Buster has a plan. Ash and Scout are pretending to think that Bandit is Buster. Bandit is looking at himself in the reflection. Wait a second, now there are two bandits! Bandit is a bit confused and a bit scared. Where have the others gone? Buster's plan worked. Bandit has been caught in the act. And here's Terry with more sweets. He's confused by the two zombies. He's given them to Bandit again. But Bandit is sharing it with Buster. What a funny mix-up. Happy Halloween! Buster and his friends are having a great time camping in the woods with Daddy Bus. Daddy is making some spooky shadows as he tells them a ghost story. Whoa, that monster is super scary! Phew, don't worry gang, it's only Daddy Bus. Looks like it's time for bed. Good night everyone! Daddy Bus is off to collect some more firewood for the fire. Good night, Buster. Hang on. What is Buster up to? He's turning the firewood into scary antlers. Scout is fast asleep. Yikes! What is that? <gasps> it's Buster's scary shadow. Poor Scout! <laughs> Don't worry, Scout. It was only Buster. <laughs> now it's Bandit's turn to be pranked. Aha! The spooky shadow scared him as well. Looks like Buster is getting sleepy. But Bandit and Scout have a plan. Buster is sleeping peacefully. <gasps> but there's a scary monster! And another one! Go, Buster, go! That serves Buster right. Great job, gang. What is that? Oh no, it's a real spooky monster. Phew, it was just Daddy Bus carrying back more firewood. That's enough scaring for one evening. All that joking around has made them very tired. Hey there, Buster. He's going for a drive with Scout. Look, there's Tony the delivery truck. Looks like Scout and Buster are going to follow Tony to see where he's going today. They're having so much fun together. <laughs> Silly Scout. Buster isn't paying attention to the road. Watch out, Buster. Whew, that was a close one. Pay attention, Buster. You nearly crashed into the back of Tony. Oh, look. 
There's a pothole in the road, and Tony is heading straight for it. Oh no! The pothole has caused Tony's doors to unlock. Watch out, Buster and Scout. It looks like some of those boxes might tumble out. The boxes have started to fly out into the road. I don't think Tony has even noticed. And another box is about to fall out. Wow, quick thinking, Buster. Great catch. Here comes another one. Well done, Scout. Great work. Oh no! Be careful, Scout. Scout has lost control and skidded off the road. Her box has gone flying up into that tree. Oh look, Tony is going to have to stop at that red light. This will buy you some time. Quickly, Buster, you haven't got long to return the boxes. <laughs> nice thinking, Buster. Now all you need to do is work out how to load the boxes back where they belong. It looks like Scout has an idea. Great work, Scout. You can use that plank of wood as a ramp. There we go. A perfect place to unload the boxes. Great teamwork. <laughs> Now you can close the doors, Buster. Just in time for the green light. Off Tony goes. I guess he'll never know how close he came to losing all of his boxes. Well done, Buster. Well done, Scout. Hey there, Buster. Oh, you're looking a little tired. Buster's fallen asleep. And what's this? Whiskers, a button nose, and ears? It's Easter Bunny Buster. Looking good. I think he likes his new bunny tail. Wonder where he's off to. Off to do some Easter bunny errands, I hope. Oh, what's this? It's a burrow in the side of that hill. I wonder where this leads. Here he comes out the other side. Oh, look. Terry Tractor is having a nap. Wow. Easter bunny Buster has given Terry a colorful Easter egg. Off he goes to spread more Easter joy. <laughs> I wonder where this burrow leads. Over here, Bunny Buster. Robin is fast asleep. Time to leave another surprise Easter egg for when Robin wakes up. Back into another burrow he goes. Who's this? It's Jessie the Jeep. Aw, she's sleeping. Easter Bunny Buster has left another egg for her when she wakes up. Such a busy little Easter Bunny Buster. These eggs won't deliver themselves. I wonder who else Bunny Buster has an egg for. It's Digger the Excavator. Quiet, Buster. Try not to wake him. <laughs> There's an egg in Digger's bucket. Great idea, Bunny Buster. Oh dear, I think Easter Bunny Buster is feeling a little tired. Wake up, Buster. Aw, huh? Easter Bunny Buster was all huh? a dream. What a shame <laughs> the eggs weren't real. But what's this? It's an Easter egg. Oh, wow. The real Easter Bunny has left Buster an Easter egg. What a lucky little bus. It's Buster the bus. Look, he's seen a cute little Easter Bunny. Whoa! Buster has turned into a bunny bus. He's going to dance the bunny dance for us. Hop, hop, hop. Then wiggle your tail. Great! <laughs> then jump up as high as you can. Just like a bunny rabbit. Then wiggle your nose. There! You've got it! <laughs> that was so much fun. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Hop, hop, hop. You're doing great! Wiggle, 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 hop, hop, hop. Spin in a circle and wiggle your nose. Yay! Hey, it's Scout the car. I think she wants to learn the bunny dance too. Are you ready? Hop, hop, hop. Then wiggle your tail. Yes. Then jump up as high as you can. Reach up high. Then wiggle your nose. That's it. Scout's got it! Now watch this! Wiggle to the left. Wiggle to the right. Wiggle as much as you can. Hey, this is fun! 
<laughs> wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Hop, hop, hop. That's right. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Hop, hop, hop. Oh, it was just Buster's dream. But never mind. We still learned a really cool new dance. I can't wait to see the shooting stars. By my calculations, the best place to see them will be up the top of the mountain. Loading map. It's go time. This way. Follow me. Uh, shouldn't we stick to the road? We'll get to the shooting stars in time. Promise. Uh, <gasps> We're gonna be stopping forever! I knew this stupid shortcut was a bad idea. Why can you just go the way I wanted for once? Now we're gonna miss the shooting stars. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> oh, wait! That's it! Diggly, what happens when you add water to mud? I don't know. It goes gloopy, I guess. That's right! And if you make it gloopy enough... <laughs> we'll slide out! Ash! Splash! It's working! Look out! The cliff edge! Ah! It's not a cliff edge, it's a stop jump! Follow me! You, that was some shortcut. Look! Ooh. <gasps> this is a great viewing spot. We made it after all. Woohoo! I love the mountain! <laughs> Snow is the best! These bumpy bumps are the funnest fun! <gasps> Whoa, that jump looks awesome! awesome. Let's do it, Bob! Sure, guys. What if we crash? Come on, Ash. You're a super fire truck. You can do anything. Come on, Bumper Bunch. Let's move. Ash, help us, please! <gasps> I got this! Whoa! <gasps> <gasps> sorry, guys! I can't do it! Don't be sorry, Ash. You can do anything, remember? You're a super fire truck. Hmm. You're doing it. Keep going. You got this, Ash. Whoa, this isn't helping. I feel dizzy. We're nearly at the bottom of the mountain. Mountain. <laughs> Sounds like you both had a big bump. It was really big. Yeah, probably the biggest jump in the world. Oh, that's cold. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> that tickles. Well, you're both very brave, <laughs> but especially you, Ash. Buster told me fire trucks can do anything. You saved the day. He really did. Thank you, Jada. No, thank you. Now, what you two need is a good rest to get fully charged. Next time, Scout, we'll land that jump. I heard that! 
look, there's Scout, and there's Buster. I think they're playing tag. What's Buster seen? Oh, wow, a maze. Scout is going inside. Go on, Buster, try and find her. I wonder which way Scout went. There she is. Off they go, winding their way through the maze. Which way should Buster go now? This way. Oh, look, a yellow flower. How nice. A few more turns and which way this time? This way. Wait a minute, it's that flower again. Buster's gone round in circles. Maybe if he backs up, he can find his way out. There's Scout. She looks lost too. Whoa, Buster and Scout have found each other. Thank goodness. But now they need to find the way out. Scout is balancing on Buster's roof. Maybe she can see a way out. There it is. Good job, Scout. <laughs> They're speeding off towards the exit. But which way is it? Oh dear, they're still lost in the maze. Look, tire tracks. They can follow those all the way to the way out. Good thinking, Buster. There's that flower again. A little further and hooray! They made it out. Great teamwork, guys. <laughs> Look, it's Rita the sports car. She's speeding into the maze. Oh well, I guess Buster and Scout will have to help her find her way out. It's Halloween and Buster is having a party. <laughs> He's looking for a cool costume to make himself super scary. What has he found? Whoa, Buster is dressed up as a cowboy. Awesome. Time to put this costume to the test. Boo, Buster tries to scare mommy. Did it work? Hmm, maybe the cowboy costume isn't scary enough. He needs to find something scarier. Aha, he's got it. Arr! He's a pirate! This is going to be much scarier. Oops! Be careful, Buster! There's Grandpa Bus! Scare him, Buster! Arr! Oh dear! Buster is still not scary enough! But looks like he's got an idea. Hang on a second. Where has Grandpa's laundry gone? It's time for snacks. <laughs> what was that? There's a noise coming from that shed. But what is making that noise? It's a bit spooky. Wait a second, I recognize that giggle. It was Buster all along. That was definitely a scary costume. Sounds like people have arrived for the party. And mommy has a plan. Ash and Scout have arrived. They're so excited. Hmm. There's nobody there. They're a little bit scared. <gasps> what is that? Boo! Ah! Run away! <laughs> Don't worry, Ash and Scout. It was just Buster. <laughs> what a great prank and a very scary <laughs> costume. I think Buster is sleeping again. Where are you, Buster? 
Look at all the huh? giant colored huh? balls and toys. Huh? It looks like a great place for an adventure. Let's see what else Buster can find. <laughs> wow! Look at that teddy bear. Look how big it is. He looks soft and cuddly. Aw, that's it, Buster. Have a nice big cuddle. He looks so cuddly. Oh no, Buster. What's that noise? It's a giant claw. Huh? I think Buster is inside a giant claw machine. Buster, watch out. It's going to get you. Oh. Go, Buster. Oh, no. Ah. <gasps> Buster, it was just a bad dream. Look, it's Scout. Oh. It looks like Buster is still a bit shaken up. But you don't need to worry anymore, Buster. <laughs> <laughs> Look, Buster, Scout has something to show you. <laughs> I wonder what it is. <laughs> oh no, it's a claw machine. Buster looks frightened. <laughs> Scout's not scared of it. Maybe it's fun. Don't worry, Buster. Scout's with you. <gasps> Look, Buster, it's that teddy. Why don't you try and win it? Come on, Buster, just be brave. You can do it. Okay, Buster, let's get this teddy. Take it easy. That looks about right. Okay, here goes. Did you get it? What's that? Oh, it's a little yellow bus. That toy looks just like you, Buster. Huh? <laughs> that makes Scout and Buster laugh. Buster has gotten over his fear of the claw machine now. Hey there, Buster. That's a great looking shark poster oh. you've got there. Oh, Buster's looking really tired. I wonder what he'll dream about. What's this? Fins? Coral? Oh, wow, Buster. I think you're under the sea. Look at Buster go! The ocean is his new playground. Isn't it beautiful? Go for it, Buster! Jump into the sky! This is so much fun! Wait, what's that? It's a huge fish! Quick, Buster, hide! Oh, look! He's not big at all! He's tiny! It's okay, Buster. Nothing to worry about. But what's this? It's Sham the Shark! Look at all those sharp teeth! Hide, Buster! Quit! Oh no! Buster has spun around the little fish, and now he's heading right for the shark! Sham the shark seems very keen to make friends, but it looks like everyone is scared of him! Quick, little fish! Hide next to Buster! Wait a minute, the shark looks sad! Really sad! You know, Buster, I think that Sham is lonely! He was just being friendly. He doesn't have any friends. That's right, Buster. Go and say hello to him. See? He just wants someone to play with. Buster and Sham are having so much fun. The ocean is a great place to play chase and to make new friends. Look at them go. Oh, Buster's waking up. It was only a dream. You don't have any fins now, Buster. You're back to being a bus again. What a lovely underwater adventure. Buster and Cozy Coop are playing in the park. There's Iggy the ice cream truck. Buster's going to grab some ice cream. But what's that? It's Robot Buster. He's turned yellow like Buster. Cozy thinks it's the real Buster and wants to play. But oh no! The ball hit robot switch and it turned him mean. <laughs> robot Buster is leading Cozy away. Now Buster is back, but he doesn't know where Cozy went. Poor Buster. There's Iggy. What's Robot Buster up to? Oh no! He's throwing tomatoes at Iggy. That's very mean. Cozy looks very upset. Huh? 
Robot Buster is running away now. Poor Cozy doesn't understand. Meanwhile, Terry is playing the accordion. Nice. <laughs> oh no! Robot Buster smashed the accordion. Poor Terry. Cozy is standing up to Robot. That was really mean. But what's this? <laughs> it's Buster! Hooray! There's the good bad switch. Cozy knows what to do. <laughs> Flick! Now Robot Buster is nice again. Good job, Cozy and Buster. Now Robot Buster is making up for being mean. Iggy's all clean, and Terry's accordion is fixed. <laughs> Hooray! Space. This is our solar system. Space is so cool. I brought my alien today. This is Mercury, the orange planet, Neptune, the blue planet, and Saturn, the yellow planet, with a ring. And this is Mars, the red planet. It's our nearest neighbor. I want to go to Mars. <laughs> Good for you, Buster. Reach for the stars. The first bus to put wheels on Mars. <laughs> Watch out for those asteroids, Buster. <laughs> Space is awesome. I wish we could go up there. It's Super Buster. Flying through space like a rocket! And Speedy Scout! Zooming across the universe like a... Um, <laughs> car! Come on, let's explore space! What's up, little alien dude? Bleep, 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 bloop, 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 beep, boop! Oh, gee! That's a real sad story. Wait, you can understand what he's saying? Of course. Alien says they're lost, so we need to help them find their way home. To Mars! The Red Planet. You got it, Scout. Let's go! <laughs> Not this one. The blue planet is Neptune. Blue, blue. That's Neptune in alien language. I was an alien, I would live here. Woohoo! <laughs> this is Saturn. Bloop, bloop. Yeah, that's what I said. Look out, Scout! Asteroids up ahead! Hang on, little buddy! This could get bumpy! <gasps> <Ooh. laughs> Woohoo! Go, Alien! Mars, the red planet. Blue, blue. We made it. There's your home. <laughs> blue, blue, blue. <laughs> that was fun. Happy holidays, Buster. Oh no, Buster doesn't look very happy, does he? Let's go and see what's wrong with him. Buster seems very bored. Has he run out of things to do? <gasps> Did you hear that, everyone? Yes, it's Buster's friend, the Robin. But where could he be? I can't see him anywhere, can you? That's a very big sigh from Buster. <gasps> oh, look, there he is. And he's carrying Buster's bobble. I think he wants you to follow him, Buster. Go on, let's see what he wants to show you. Oh, he is bringing back a scarf. Huh? Great idea, Buster. <laughs> you should both build a snowman. <laughs> Look at him, using his wheels to pile up all the snow. Clever, Buster. Wow, it's already taking shape. And there's the head. Well done, Robin. A snowman isn't complete without his scarf. <gasps> what are those pieces of coal for? Of course. 
Now the robin's gone to find something else. Oh yes, a carrot for their snowman's nose. What a fantastic snowman. But look, Buster thinks something's missing. Wow, that's a big gust of wind. And look, it's blown a top hat to Buster and the robin. That's what was missing. Well done, Buster. The robin certainly agrees. <laughs> oh, wow. The snowman has come alive. Buster is so excited. Buster now has not only the robin to play with, but his new snowman friend, too. Happy holidays, everyone. I wonder what Buster's going to learn at school today. Oh, a volcano. Wow. They're going to do an experiment. The teacher is showing them what to do. First, a drop of white powder. Then three drops of food coloring. Then some vinegar to make it all bubbly. Wow, it looks like an erupting volcano. Isn't that amazing? Everyone is so excited. They're going to do the experiment all by themselves. What a mess. It looks like Bandit didn't do it right. Oh no! Scouts didn't go right either. Maybe Buster? Buster has made just as much mess as the others. Why isn't it working? Can Ash get it right? Buster is going to check. Ash is still putting ingredients in. Whoa! It worked! Nice work, Ash! But how did Ash get it right when everyone else's went wrong? Oh, he followed the instructions on the board! What a good idea! The teacher is proud of Ash. Now the others are going to try again. But first, they check what they need to do. One drop of white powder. Then three drops of food coloring. Then some vinegar to make it all bubbly. <laughs> Hooray! It's working! The volcanoes are all bubbling over. Don't they look great? Good job, everyone! It's amazing what you can do when you follow the instructions. The teacher is so proud of everyone. Buster and Ash are on holiday at the beach. Mommy Bus and Mommy Fire Truck are preparing a barbecue. And Buster and Ash are building an amazing sand castle. Whoa, those waves are really coming in. Quick, the sand castle could be ruined. Ash to the rescue. He's protecting the castle with a wall of sand. Great idea, Ash. Oh, look, it's Iggy, the ice cream truck. Hooray! <laughs> oh, no! Ash's wall couldn't stop the waves. They've ruined their sand castle. Buster is very sad. But Ash has got a plan to save it. Buster is too upset to help. <laughs> Maybe an ice cream will cheer him up. I wonder what flavors he'll choose. Wow, that's a huge ice cream. Whoa, steady. Ash is still fixing the sand castle. Buster could get Ash an ice cream too. But he's upset with Ash because his wall didn't protect the sand castle. Buster's only getting ice cream for himself. Whoa! Ash has rebuilt the sand castle. Good as new! Buster now feels bad he didn't get Ash an ice cream. So he's giving Ash his. Be careful, don't drop it. Iggy gives them another cone. Now they can share the ice cream. Yum, yum, delicious. Hey, Buster. Oh no, Buster looks really ill. <laughs> Hello, Scout. I think Scout wants to play. I don't think Buster is well enough to play today. 
Buster's feeling really ill. Quick, Scout, go and get some help. Oh, poor Buster. It'll be okay. We all get poorly now and then. Oh, look. Scout has brought Amber the ambulance to have a look at Buster. Great idea, Scout. Amber will know what to do to make Buster feel better. It looks like Amber the ambulance is helping Buster back into his garage. Let's see if she can find what's wrong with Buster. Firstly, let's check Buster's tires. Oh, look. This one has lost all of its air. It needs pumping up. There we go. That's better. Buster looks better already. Oh, but you're still a bit under the weather. Ah, yes. Let's check Buster's temperature with a thermometer. It doesn't look good, Buster. It's time for Amber to check Buster's engine. Oh, no! Buster's leaking oil! No wonder he's not feeling well. Amber will fix this with her spanner. It's okay, Buster. It'll be done soon. Just a few more turns. There we go. Great job, Amber! Buster looks like he's back to his normal self again. I think you're well enough to go out and play, Buster. Oh, he seems very pleased. That's the Buster we know and love. It's time for Amber to head off. Bye, Amber. Thank you for looking after Buster. <laughs> off Scout and Buster go to play. Bye. <laughs> oh. Uh, Buster? <laughs> Buster! Surprise! Happy birthday, Scout! You didn't think I'd forget my best friend's birthday, did you? Oh, thanks, Buster! It looks, uh, delicious? <laughs> oh, it was delicious. But don't worry, Scout, I have more surprises! <laughs> Follow me! But close your eyes, no peeking! <laughs> <laughs> no peeking now. Buster, where are we going? Ah, it's Ooh. a surprise. Is it the racetrack? Wait, I know. Are we going to the disco tunnel? Even better. You'll see. Okay, peek. Wait, no, wait, surprise. Uh, what are we doing in Jada's garage, Buster? You'll see. It's a special surprise. Did I mention it's a surprise? Ready, Scout? Uh, sure. We're gonna turn you into a race car. You'll be the speediest car in the whole town. Go, go, go! Buster, <laughs> you missed one. This is fun. It sure does take a long time, though. But it's worth it. Only the best for my best friend. Uh, Buster? Maybe I'll be a mechanic someday. Buster! Oops! <laughs> Sorry, Scout. I promise my painting will be better. Painting? But we've just come from the car wash. Oh, double oops. That was a surprise too. Come on. Uh, everything okay, mm. Buster? Um, yup. <gasps> oh no, I've used the wrong colors. I just wanted to make you feel special on your birthday. Now I've messed it all up. I'm sorry. Don't be sorry. I've had the best day. This is so much fun. It is? Of course. What could be more fun than messing around in the <laughs> garage with my best friend? Woohoo! But we were supposed to have a photo. Not yet. I've got a great idea. Buster, it's time for a makeover. Hmm, not like buses to be late. <gasps> Whoa! <laughs> this was the best birthday ever. You're welcome, Scout. This was so much fun. <laughs> Ready, Diggly? Sure. You look super cool. It's nap time in Buster's garage. Have a nice sleep, Buster. But who's this? It's a robot bus. Oh no, he's come to cause mischief. He's made himself look like Buster. 
Oh, hey, Scout. She's practicing her ball skills for the football match. Here comes Robot Bus. I think Scout thinks it's Buster, not a Robot Bus. Oh, dear. Robot Bus has squashed Scout's football. What a nasty thing to do. Poor Scout is very upset. It's Jessie G. She's waiting for the green light. There it is. Oh, that was a close one. It's Robot Bus up to mischief again. Oh, no, Jessie thinks that's the real Buster. Oh, little Robin, be careful. Robot Bus isn't very friendly. Oh, poor Robin. Bad Robot Bus. Hey, Digger. He's having fun with his building block. Oh, no, Robot Bus has come to join in. He's ruined Digger's pyramid of blocks. Robot Bus is causing chaos. Here's the real Buster the Bus. <gasps> Waking from his nap. Oh dear, everyone is angry at you, Buster. They think Robot Bus was you. How can you prove that you didn't do all these mean things? Robot Bus has come to cause more chaos. Quick, Digger, there's a switch on his roof. Oh, look, he's been set to bad. Switch it to good, Digger. Well done, Digger. That seems to have done the trick. It looks like Robot Bus has gone back to normal now. Oh? <laughs> well done, everyone. That was a close one. Robot Bus could have terrorized the whole town. <laughs> Bye, everyone. Look around and hear the fairy tale of Buster the Wizard. There's Buster the Bus. Looks like he's driving through the enchanted forest. But wait, what's this by the road? I think it's a spell book. Wow, Buster can use that to do magic. Look, it's Scout, Terry, and Jesse in the town square. I think Buster's going to try casting some spells. Let's see now. Whoa, a wizard's hat. Buster really is doing magic. I wonder what spell Buster can use to help Terry. Abracadabra. Wow, Buster made the plants grow. Nice work, wizard Buster. What other spells are in the spell book? The bee spell? <laughs> oh, look! Buster turned Scout into a bee! She's having so much fun flying around! I think Jessie wants to fly, too! What spells are there for that? Bubbles? Cool! Jessie's floating around in her own bubble! Nice work, Wizard Buster! Oh, look! He's very sleepy! Time for a nap, Buster! Uh-oh, I think something's gone wrong. The magic is out of control. Quick, Buster, you've got to put everything back to normal. Hurry, Buster. Uh. Phew, all the spells are canceled. But I don't think Buster's friends are very happy with him. Buster's putting the spell book back where he found it. And that's the end of the fairy tale of Buster the Wizard. Oh, whoa! It's time for the Christmas talent show. Bandit is going first. He's doing some magic tricks. Good job, Bandit. Aw, Buster looks nervous. I think he's got a bit of stage fright. Poor Buster. There's Scout. It's her turn next. She looks so excited. Oh, cool. She's going to do some juggling. Very good, Scout. Oh, dear. Buster still looks nervous. He's afraid to go on stage in front of all those people. Hooray! Scout's finished her show. Now it's Buster's turn. Aw, but Buster doesn't want to go on stage. Mm. <laughs> Mommy's getting worried about Buster. The stage is empty. I think Mommy has an idea. What's this? Mommy's on stage. She's encouraging Buster to come join her. They'll do it together. Here, 
Monster Buster comes. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Good tidings we bring, with Buster we sing. We wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Merry Christmas! <laughs> oh, well done, Buster and Mommy. That was beautiful. <laughs> Buster is heading off to school. Wait a second, Buster. Don't forget, it's school photo day today. So you need an extra polish. <laughs> Bye, Mommy Bus. Look! Terry Tractor is here to take the school photos. Bandit and Ash are up first. Smile! Buster's turn next. And he wants to get an action shot. Whoops! Buster slipped! Watch out, Scout! Oh no, what's wrong? The teacher is handing Buster a mirror. Buster has knocked out his wobbly front tooth! Oh no! And now Buster is too embarrassed to have his photo taken. It's okay, Buster. You can have it taken another day. Buster is feeling really sad about missing out on the photos. But Mommy Bus is here to pick him up. And she's taking him to the dentist to get his tooth looked at. Hooray! Buster is a little bit nervous. Don't worry, Buster. Amber the Ambulance is here to take a look at that tooth for you. It's time to sit in the special dentist chair. Wow, that looks like so much fun! And now it's time to check that tooth. Don't worry, Buster. There's nothing to be scared of. First, Amber is looking at the tooth with a little mirror. Open wide, Buster. Say, ah. Uh. And what's that? Amber's going to play Buster a video. It's another bus, just like Buster. And his tooth has fallen out. But don't worry, another one will grow in its place. He might be missing a tooth for now, but soon he'll have a brand new one. So there's nothing to be embarrassed about. Buster now feels much better. Thanks, Amber. And now he's going back to school to get his photo taken. Gather in, Buster. Say cheese. There's Buster and Scout <laughs> driving home. Wait, what was that? Oh, wow. It's a little baby reindeer. She must be lost. Buster is trying to cheer her up. Aw, I think she wants to play. <laughs> She's a jumpy little girl. Now Buster's throwing a snowball. Oops! <laughs> Sorry, Scout. <laughs> it's fun to play with new friends. <gasps> now Buster has built a snow ramp. I wonder what he's up to. Vroom! Buster's doing a big jump. Now it's the baby reindeer's turn. Whoosh! <laughs> now Scout. Oh. Oops! <laughs> Sorry, Buster. <gasps> but where's the baby reindeer gone? They're following the footprints. There! She was playing hide and seek. Where's Scout going? Hmm, a big pile of snow. 
Oh, look! It's Scout! Whoa! More reindeer footprints! Bigger ones! I wonder where they lead! I think the friends are going to follow them! The tracks are winding all through the trees! Look! It's Mommy and Daddy reindeer! They're so happy they found Baby! Baby reindeer has had so much fun playing with Buster and Scout! But now it's time to say goodbye! Bye, Baby reindeer! See you again soon! Buster the bus and Terry tractor! It looks like they're about to have a race! Buster looks very confident, doesn't he? Terry doesn't seem too impressed. I wonder who's going to win. Here we go. Ready, set, go! And they're away. Buster races into the lead. Come on, Terry, you can do it. I don't think Terry is as fast as Buster. Wait, what's he doing? Oh, cheeky Buster. He's showing off. Poor Terry. Buster sure is confident that he's going to win. You're not at the finish line yet, Buster. Keep going, Terry. You still have a chance. Oh, Buster, don't tease Terry. You're not being very nice. Go on, Terry. You'll show Buster that you don't just need speed to win a race. Buster is really far ahead now. Look at him zooming through all the muddy puddles. Oh, Buster, I know it's hot, but you can't be tired. You haven't finished the race. Look over there, it's an apple tree. I think Buster is going to take a nap in the shade. Cheeky Buster, you're getting a bit too confident, aren't you? Oh dear, Buster has fallen asleep. And look who it is. Terry Tractor! He's managed to overtake Buster! Oh, silly Buster! You've slept for too long! Off he races towards the finish line! I'm not sure he's going to like what he finds! Nearly there, Buster! But where's Terry? Haha, <laughs> there he is! Terry crossed the line first! Silly Buster, you shouldn't have slept for so long. And you shouldn't have been such a show-off. Because it goes to show, slow and steady wins the race. Bye, Buster. Bye, Terry. <laughs> Buster and Mommy Bus are visiting Terry's farm today. <gasps> wow, the farm is so cool. Buster is so excited. <laughs> Oh, look! An adorable litter of puppies! How cute! Buster has spotted a soccer ball. He loves soccer. <laughs> Mommy Bus is here to check that all the puppies are healthy. But Buster has other ideas. He wants to go and play some soccer on the farm. <laughs> yeah. What was that? Oh. One of the puppies followed Buster outside. <gasps> Looks like she wants to play. <laughs> hmm, but Buster wants to play by himself. <laughs> there she is again. The puppy won't stop following him. <laughs> Buster is throwing the puppy a stick to distract her. That will make her leave. Nope, that didn't work. And now the puppy has taken the soccer ball. What a cheeky little puppy. Aha, finally Buster got his ball back. But the puppy still wants to play. Stay there, puppy. Mm. 
<laughs> Buster is hiding behind a stack of hay bales. <gasps> Not again! <gasps> Maybe Buster can lose the puppy in the cornfield. The puppy is sad she can't find him. But Buster's plan worked. <gasps> oh no! How did that puppy get up there? She's going to fall! <gasps> And Mommy Bus and Terry haven't noticed. <laughs> quick, Buster, quick! Go, Buster! Phew! He saved the puppy! That was a close one! Mommy Bus has noticed a puppy is missing. But don't worry, Buster has brought her home. What a fun day at the farm! Uh-oh, not again! <laughs> Today, we're looking at the top 10 Buster Rescues. Let's start with number 10. Buster stands up to the bully banded bus. Bandit is stealing the ball for himself. What a bully! Buster wants to do something. Poor Scout is really upset. Buster wants to help his friend. He's going to stand up to Bandit and get him to give the ball back. I don't think Bandit will listen to Buster. He's going to bully him instead. It's not fair. But wait, Jesse is standing beside Buster. Scout is here to help too. They're all fed up with Bandit being a bully. There's Otis, the police car, enjoying an ice cream. Oops, Bandit has backed into Otis. Otis looks mad. Serves Bandit right, being mean to everyone. Number nine, Buster rescues the kitten from the tree. Uh-oh. She's stuck up in that tall tree. You've got to rescue her, Buster. Of course! Buster's brought Ashley the fire truck. She'll be able to reach the kitten with her tall ladder. There we go. <laughs> the kitten will be safe now. Oh no, I think the kitten is too scared to come down the ladder. I wonder what Buster has planned. Oh yes! The kitten's ball of wool. She'll come down to play with that. Look how happy the kitten is. Here she comes down the ladder. There, safe and sound. Nice work, Buster. Number eight. Buster rescues Scout from Bandit the Bus. Scout, watch out. Poor Scout. <laughs> Look who it is! You're in trouble now! Super Buster is here! Buster, you can stop him! <laughs> Super Buster is too strong for Bandit! That should stop him! Phew. Now Buster just needs to help Scout out of the <laughs> pond! Haha! <laughs> Look at Bandit! Number 7! Buster rescues Scout from the cracked ice! Oh wow, look at Buster flying through the air! Look, you've cracked the ice! <laughs> the ice is cracking even more! And it's cracked around <laughs> Scout! She's trapped! Buster, what are you going to do? If you go any closer, the ice will surely break! Great idea! Mr. Snowman won't break the ice! Please, will you help Mr. Snowman? Look at him go! He's saving Scout! Well done, Mr. Snowman! <laughs> and nice quick thinking, Buster! <laughs> Number 6! Buster rescues the Wild West from Bandit the Bus! Great work, Buster! Now you're a proper cowboy! Wait! <gasps> it's Bandit Bus! And what's that on his back? A sack? 
I think he's robbed the sweet shop. What a villain he is. You must stop him, Buster. <laughs> Quick, Buster. He's getting away. Bandit is trying to lose Buster in the cactus field. Careful, Buster. Those are really spiky. You've almost caught him. Look out! Are you okay, Buster? Oh, no! The cactus has punctured your tire. Oh, no. You'll never catch him with a flat tire. Wait, huh? of course! The lasso! Rope him up, Buster. One, two, three, go! Great! You did it! You caught Bandit! And here's Sheriff Otis. I'm sure he's really grateful. There. Bandit is in the jailhouse where he belongs. Number five. Buster rescues Scout from the storm. It's a thunderstorm. Oh, look out for Scout, Buster. The lightning is everywhere now. Phew. Buster's safe and sound in the garage. But what about Scout? She really is stuck in that puddle. Hmm. Will Buster be brave enough to go and help her? <laughs> Scout's really struggling. Hmm. You can do it, Buster. Wow, the lightning is so bright and scary. Yay! Go, Buster! <laughs> he looks very determined to help Scout now. A quick push should do the trick. Huh? Oh. Yay! Scout's free! Look how happy she is! Well done, Buster! Oh, but look! Buster has overcome his fear! Buster and Scout are happily heading back to the garage to get in from the rain! Number four! Buster rescues the town from the fire! Hey, it's Tony the truck! Watch out for that puddle! Oh no! That falling box started a fire! At the fire station! What are we going to do? <gasps> Quick, Buster the fire truck! Put that fire out! Uh oh! The fire has spread to the roof! Keep blasting water, Buster! Hooray! Robin is here to help! And Ashley's back too! <gasps> You can do it if you work together. Two fire trucks are better than one. Phew! The fire is out at last. Nice work, Buster and Ashley. <laughs> Number three. Super Buster rescues Otis. What has Buster seen? It's Otis the police car. I wonder what Otis is looking for inside the tunnel. Wait, it's Bandit the bus. What is he up to? This doesn't look good. Oh no! He's pushed the boulder over the edge and trapped Otis in the tunnel. You've got to save him, Buster. You can't let Bandit the bus get away with this. That boulder looks very heavy. It's okay, Buster. You're a superhero now. You can save him. Oh, Buster, your eyes. Wow, you have laser vision. Well done, Buster. You've set Otis free. Now let's catch that naughty bandit bus. Number two. Buster rescues Santa and saves Christmas. What's that you can see in the sky? Oh, wow. It's Santa's sleigh. He's going very fast. Uh-oh. I think he's going to crash. Quick, Buster. Go and see if Santa needs any help. Whoa. There's the sleigh and the reindeer. And look. There's Santa himself. Oh. oh dear, the sleigh Ooh. is broken. How will Santa deliver all the presents Ooh. in time now? Ooh. <laughs> I wonder if there's anything Buster can do to help. Hmm. Hmm. I think Santa has an idea. I wonder Ooh. what he's got in mind. <laughs> Wait, wow! Buster is flying! Ooh. Just like Santa's sleigh. <laughs> now they can deliver the presents in time. Number one. Buster rescues Suki the train. Whoa, 
That was a close one. Wasn't Suki the train looking where she was going? There's Otis the police car. Something must be wrong. Quick, Buster, maybe you can help. Oh no, Suki has fallen asleep on the job. What's Buster seeing now? Oh dear, it's Digger. Suki is heading right towards him and he hasn't even noticed. Another track, it goes up a hill too. Look out, Buster. Phew, that was close. Well ducked, Buster. You need to change the tracks, Buster, so Suki goes up the hill. Hurry, Buster. You can do it. Almost there. Yes, just in time. Well done, Buster. You changed the track. Suki is heading up a steep hill. That'll slow her down. There. At last, she stopped safely. I think Suki is waking up. Thank goodness nobody was hurt. Well done, Buster. You helped Otis and saved the day. Wow, those were so exciting. It's a good thing Buster the Bus is always there to save the day. Da, 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 da. Come on, Bumper Bunch, let's move. This way to the Zipsu Racetrack. Watch out for Speedy Scouts. Slow down, Buster. Going on here. Hey, Mr. Rubble. Uh, how are you? We were just um speeding to the racetrack. Nothing interesting here. No paint explosions at all. Uh, that's a nice hat. Is it new? There's something funny going on here. I feel it in my hubcaps. Nobody can trick Mr. Rubble. Nobody. I can sense mischief. Mr. Rubble, no! <laughs> Buster, Bandit and Scout are having a sleepover. But they're still <laughs> wide awake. They're having a great time staying up. They're too excited to go to sleep. <gasps> Who's that? It's Grandpa Bus. He says it's getting late. It's time to go to bed. They can't play games and be up all night. Huh. 
Hmm, maybe this nightlight will help them get to sleep. Wow, look at those stars. Buster loves stars. He wonders what it would be like to be a space rocket flying fast through them. Oh, look, it's space rocket Buster. Buster and his friends are using their imagination. They're flying through space. Check it out. There's Earth. They're going to race to it. Ready? Steady, go! Buster is in the lead. Oh no! Bandit knocked him off course! Aw, oh, now Buster's far behind. How can he zoom back ahead? Aha! Whoa! Buster is spinning around Saturn! Now he's going really fast! What a clever idea! He's overtaking Bandit and Scout. Hmm, what's Bandit up to now? <gasps> Careful! Meteors! Bandit is throwing them at Buster and Scout. Hmm, they have to stop him. They're throwing an even bigger meteor back at Bandit. That'll teach him. And the race is back on. Buster and Scout are neck and neck. Nearly there. Space Rocket Buster wins the race. Way to go! Uh-oh. Busted. Again. Grandpa heard them playing. That was a lot of fun, but now it really is time to go to bed. Good night, everyone.